Anybody out there in TV land? A couple few of you, maybe? Ready for a stream? Mm -hmm. Ready for a party? Have some fun? Get some giveaways? Some pre-giveaways? Gonna do some uh, trivia tonight. You guys can play, play some trivia with us. Are you sure that's not BS? Yeah, it might be. It's either brilliant or BS, one of the two. Peter, Peter, thanks for showing up, man. I'm putting you guys' names in the basket already. Um, Peter's is for oh, yeah, Patreon. Patreon supporters. Danny Dawson, Drew Dunlap. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Vinny, well. Gary, Vinny, Vinny, Walters, Gary, Dan, Drew, you guys. Man, you guys show up every week. Come on, Patreon support me. Give me a dollar. Now I can afford to do overlays on the video thanks, <laughs> to, my, thanks to my Patreons. You guys rock. I love y'all. I just, I, I just like you guys showing up, though. Patreon. Carly! There's another Patreon supporter. Yeah. Michael, you have to know me now. Are we here now? We're we live? Yeah, Man, you gotta do a 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Never. He's terrible at it. This will take months for him to figure it out. He goes 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and then we're live. And we're live! Thank you, Grant, for the wonderful countdown to another Unfiltered Gamer live stream. David, nice to see you again. And Josh, welcome aboard, guys. Hope you guys are having a great night tonight. We're going to be playing some games, as always. Party games. And then I think we're going to play uh, the Towers of Arkanos. So you guys get to check, check that out. If you like games like Sagrada, puzzle games, you're going to dig this game as well. Uh, we're also going to play the game Brilliant or BS. Hashtag family friendly. Hashtag family friendly, okay? And we're going to be playing uh, basically a game which we're going to be doing some trivia with each other. But it doesn't matter if you know the answers or not, as long as you can lie. Oh, I know. And I'm very good at that. I know everything. Yeah, well, that's, I'm glad you do, because yeah. I certainly do as well, in fact. Yeah. And we got a lot of games to talk to you guys about tonight, as well as talking about some other stuff. So let's first go ahead and put up... we got overlays going on right now. If we don't, let's start by talking about Gen Con or Origins. Origins is next week. Origins is on Wednesday of next week, and because of that, we're going to be doing this Tuesday. Tuesday of next week, we're going to have the guys from Fickle, which is currently on Kickstarter. It's a game we reviewed. It's excellent. A whole lot of fun. Eric, thank you for showing up, man. And you guys get a chance to check out that game live on stream to see if you want to back that one as well. We're getting a lot of creators. We're going to have a lot of creators coming on for each and every week throughout the next couple months here, so it'll be some fun for sure. So Origins... That'll be next Wednesday, so this next stream will be on Tuesday. Tuesday, 7.30, same deal, just a day earlier. So weird. Right? <laughs> uh, we're also going to be giving away a special game today. We might, I think we have some sponsored giveaways as well, but Ferdinand, the cardboard stacker, is here. And because of that, we're going to give away a game called... Ice Cool. Ice Cool. It's a family-based game in which you're going to be flicking penguins. Yeah. It's got a little dexterity involved, or a lot of bit of dexterity. I hope you stay cool during the summer. Oh, it is. It's going to be hot in here. Really hot. Yeah. Dad jokes. That's what we You're got so going funny. for you. Pedro, <laughs> man, thank you for showing up, guys. Captain. Captain, how you doing, man? Um, if you guys would like, you guys go ahead and like and subscribe to Unfiltered Gamer and the Cardboard Stacker. That'll get you an entry in for Ice Cool, too. So if you subscribe to Unfiltered Gamer and cardboard stacker it's a good way to get yourself in let us know that you subscribe to this wonderful gentleman here and uh you can go ahead and get yourself a little copy of ice cool tonight if you're lucky yeah. we're giving away games here oh. well, you know what it's canceled <laughs> We're done? We can't do this. We're, doing, we're yeah, stopping we tonight? Do no, okay, I guess we won't. Um, <laughs> so yeah, go ahead. Also, guys, if you'd like, uh, Patreon supporters, thank you so much. Thank you so much. You guys have been helping us helping out a lot. Uh, every little buck counts. We've gotten overlays now every month because of them. We can actually have overlays continuously showing you images of the pic of the games and whatnot. Uh, interesting little aspects to the camera and whatnot because generally it costs money, but now it won't cost us anything thanks to you guys. It's one step close to the additional giveaways um, for the stream as well, which is going to be basically, I'm going to include that as part of yeah, it. Yeah. So if you want to go and support us, you can do so. We're doing a game, uh, a game series called Unbreakable Board Games. Unbreakable Board Game is basically a series that talks about thematic aspects of games, talks about mechanics. Uh, the first one we talked about was called... Oh, my, my brain's killing me. I have so much content. Uh, what, what was it called, Grant? Uh, balancing Games. Balancing Games and how games need to, can be balanced. Asymmetrical balance, choice balance, value balance. Magic the Gathering is a very good example I thought, of that. I thought you were going to say, like, dexterity games. And you had no. An actual balance in that one. No, actual no, balance. 
No, but it's okay. We played one of those today. We're yeah. like the tower building. Yeah. Uh, so if you're interested in that, that is specifically for the first week. It's only for Patreon supporters, and it's spe specifically sponsored by you guys. So thank you so so much. It, it's uh, really good. I'm, I appreciate it. Every every person helps. We showed uh, some cool images from Tabletop Takeovers. We're going to give you some exclusives, some Origins and Gen Con, just Patreon only. Uh, images, all, all, all of the new games coming out, and even a couple playthrough videos of things that people won't see for months. So... I hope you dig it. I hope you like it. And just, I just want to give a big thanks because I really appreciate you guys. There you go, Ferdinand. Hey, thank you very much. There you go. That's all we need. That's all we need. Just that one person. You're set now for life. Yeah. Uh, but I hope you guys are excited. We got a lot of stuff going on here. Eric and Ryan. All right, man. Thank you guys. Uh, so if you would like, comment, and that's going to get you an entry into win games tonight. We're going to have three giveaways at least, as well as, of course, giving away the game Ice Cool. Share this video right now. We're going to go ahead and get started uh, for tonight's stream. So mm -hmm. if you if you haven't done so, check out the banners down below. It shows you what you can do to win, to enter to win. Yeah. All right, so the first one is Mizo Games. What you got? Uh, Jason Something's... said thank you very, very much for uh, Murder Most Foul. Oh. His wife's ah. not a gamer at all, and she actually said that, that one looked like fun. Ooh, there you go, Murder Most Foul. Oh, you're welcome. I hope you enjoyed it. It's a... Family, it's a, it's a murder mystery type of game. And Gary and Vinny say hi to you for today. Oh, hi Raid guys. on Takao. Ta. Ka. Oh. Uh, Takao. Takao. Yeah. Oh. Takao. Uh, this one here is an interesting game that is really beautiful, actually. What does it say? It says, towards the end of World War II, let me turn this down a little bit. Taiwan, under Japanese control, was an important base for southern expansions and as such was subject to few, uh, frequent air raids by U.S. bombers. Um, the city was most heavily damaged by this bombing in all of Taiwan. So Radon Takao is, is a cooperative game set in World War II in which the players are in Kaoshing as it is under air attack. Wow. Characters from different families, faiths, and races must overcome their fears to survive at the, to the end in this harbor city ravaged by the flames of armored conflict and win the final victory. So that's kind of a dark theme. Yeah. Wow. Okay, World War... It's what I thought it was going to be, a dark theme, but the artwork is really cool looking. Very, very interesting looking game. I will have a... Is this based on a different IP, like an anime, actually? Or no. Just, or just, no, it's just based original? on... It's a, based on a historical. Oh, okay. Yep. This is a city that was bombed in World War II and was used as a station for a base. Um, and so they would raid it. It was just... You know, this is basically you're playing as the players in that city, okay. the character, the people in that city, and having to go through what they went through, which was insane, right? Yeah, yeah you had that set up on your table, like... Danny, I, Danny, I guys, thank you. Vinny's kid. Vinny's kid. <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice. You're just trying to steal bonuses, aren't you? Yes, All right. he's subscribing to the Cardboard Stackers, so... Uh, I guess that oh, works. But he's using Kid 1 and Kid 2's stuff. That's how you do <laughs> it. It's cheating, but I like it. Uh, this is called The Towers of Arkanos. We'll probably play this game after we play Brilliant or BS, so if you're interested in The Towers of Arkanos, this is going to be uh, by... This is currently by Creative Games studios but it's going to be made by idw and they're going to be doing some improvements to the game from its quality and whatnot it's a game like sagrada uh we will play it tonight though so i'll go ahead and leave it to the side i read that game f f for fun <laughs> yeah. play batman yeah, I bet you guys want to see some Batman. This Batman. is called The Mask of the Red Death, and it's also by IDW. Uh, this is the exclusive Kickstarter edition. I got this uh, tabletop day. It's so nice. And it looks really, really beautiful. It's got some really, really nice artwork. It comes with a print, which is kind of cool as well. Ah, I'm so jealous. <laughs> I haven't played it yet, but I did open it. I did go through it, and I looked at the rules a little bit. It plays four to seven players, which is kind of interesting. But it's kind of fancy. Fancy, fancy. And fancy, fancy, fancy. And a clock tower, too. Yep, and then there's miniatures, of course, too. Each of the characters have some brilliant-looking miniatures. They're nice. They're, they're really nicely done. You know, you have a little... You can... And it turns the clock tower, yeah. And then, of course, you got player boards, you got character standings, all kinds of stuff. But uh, minis. Yep, it's got ten of them. Yeah, pretty nice. So, yeah, yeah. You guys better be sharing this video. We're going to have some fun doing some trivia tonight, which you guys can kind of play along as well. You can determine who of us is lying and who of us is brilliant. So that would be a fun play with us. Um... Yeah, play with us type thing. It, also, if you do if you do subscribe on Patreon, we're gonna add you to the bucket. All right, if you if you subscribe to us on Patreon, we get you. We're gonna add you to uh, give, the games we're gonna be giving away tonight, and that'll be for every week for the rest of you guys being a part of it. And uh, yeah, just just forgot to mention that. So that's uh, along with other perks that you can get. Uh, this is called Mug Shots, which is basically like Cards Against Humanity, but it's Florida Man edition, in which you're gonna actually have a character that's basically a Florida man. And then you're going to have a title, like Florida Man Attacks Flamingo at Bush Gardens. Uh -huh. And players are going to play the mug shots. You're going to try and determine which one of the mug shots works with the, Funny. Works with the title. And it's, it's, it's going to be one of those games that the internet is going to probably get behind because they, the Florida Man memes yeah, are, are, are actual, just silly. Uh, 
headlines. Yeah, these are actual headlines from what Florida men have, have done. Go we ahead. need to see another one. You want to see another Florida man headline? Florida man steals patrol car as this is a felony. Florida man tears up yard after a woman posts bad review of his wife's business. Florida man snaps with big mouth the Billy Bass singing fish after argument police, police say. say. Florida man dies after trying to remove pet pigeon from power line with 20 foot aluminum pole. Well, that that Florida man was not all that bright, I would say. But that is F Mugshot's Florida Man edition. I just got these two games in recently. Hey, 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 Clinton. Clinton, thank you. Dip more. Uh, Van, Van, uh, nice to see you again. And I'll see you soon. We're gonna be show you're going to be showing me uh, Sea Rovers. Amanda, Emma, nice to see you as well. Catherine and Tan, how you guys doing? Welcome to the show. If you guys want and you haven't done so already, go ahead and... Subscribe to Unfiltered Gamer and the Cardboard Stacker. You can get a chance to win Ice Cool the Night, as well as sharing out this video. All right, Boss Monsters and Call to Adventure. These just came in very recently by Brother Wise Games. I love these guys. I actually had to play test Boss Monsters a long time ago when it was first being made uh -huh. uh, at Majestics. It was a little TCG, or not TCG, sorry, F Friendly Local Game Store, FLG. And so I got to throw that out. They just sent me a new copy of the Rise of the Mini Boss a game, which I'm excited to go ahead and add to my collection of Boss Monsters stuff and uh call out to adventure i haven't played this one yet so i don't know much about it but i've seen it and it looks gorgeous i'm excited to try it out it's a craft your own hero choose your own ah. path claim your destiny type of game really nice artwork i will see what it's like for you guys they are the guys who did on earth as well yes uh then we got dungeon drop which we played on stream a couple weeks ago it is on kickstarter right now and it is doing fantabulous that's a word trust me it, it, Hashtag fantabulous. If it's not, it is now. I'm fairly certain. Uh, so if you're interested in taking a look at Dungeon Drop, you can watch our live stream from back then and check out the campaign. They're doing very, very well and for very good reason. It's a fun little game. Funded uh, in under two It funded hours. very quickly. Uh, <laughs> speaking of games that funded very well, Battle uh, Battle Station's Dirt Side. This one funded way quick. It's up to $100,000 already. I think I'm the only review right now on there. Uh, so... Yeah, that's what's up. We know how to do have big games. Have I seen games. this game yet? I don't know. But I don't I, think so. I have Battle... Battle... Uh, battle oh, why do I keep saying Battle Stations? It's a thing that'd be an easy name to say, right? <laughs> but uh, yeah, I have the original base yeah. game, and then I have the expansion I can show you a little later tonight. Mm -hmm. Aloha. Okay. Oh, we just have you tonight, huh? Yes, it's just me. All right, that works just fine. Lucky I got extra people Hi. to spare. Yes. How are you doing? Hello, I'm great. How are you guys? Good, good, good. Alright, I'm this over that here. Right, we're almost done, <laughs> and then we're going to go ahead and introduce you and your special fantabulous game. Another Yay, real word, I promise. Eric, the box, that's just for, like, that's the... That's proto, the proto, prototype. prototype. Like, Super proto. Yeah, yep. That is not the box that the actual game is coming in. It'll probably come in a box closer to what uh, Battle City... Yeah, yeah, battle yeah. Well, I'll, sh I will show you tonight later. Okay, so this one here is called Frenemy Pastry Party. Huh? <laughs> it is a little. Uh, it is a. It's by Miso Games as well. It's the same guys that did the World War II cooperative, avoid the air raid game that's super dark. Then they bring you Frenemy Pastry Party, <laughs> where you're playing as little cute <laughs> raccoons and stuff. Super cute. The idea is you're just trying to gather, you're trying to gather ingredients for a cake, and you're gonna play as an animal. So let me go and show you these different animals. These are the animals you can play as. Oh, oh my so god. Cute. They're super, super oh. cute. Ferdinand was gonna be into this. Uh, these are all the these are all the cakes you can make. Wow. And then these are all the ingredients for all the cakes. And basically on your turn, you're going to either choose to try and make a cake, or you're going to choose to take an ingredient uh, from the pool. There'll be a certain limited amount of a pool. And then when you bake a cake, what's quite interesting is I can say, uh, hey, Callie, do you have a blueberry that you want to give me? And then she can say, no, I don't, or yes, I do, and she can place one down. If she says yes, she can continue to give me stuff until she doesn't have anything or chooses not to have anything, in which case I can ask somebody else. When two people say no more, then that's it for me. I have to use the rest of the ingredients for my hand. If I can't, I fail at making the cake. They lose all of their stuff, and I keep mine. Makes it very dangerous to want to help people, but it's very worth it because when you get a cake, you get five points. Everybody else that helped you will get a point for every card they donate. Uh, yeah, mm. yeah. Um, so that's how that works, basically. And it is a cute, helpful game. It's a helping <laughs> game, but you're only helping to help yourself. Yeah, so. it pays to be generous. Yes, yes, it does. Let me have that game. You want this game? No, it's not. It's so cute. Maybe, maybe. I'll talk to them. See if you, see if Speaking of otter animals, this is the game I brought today. Boogie Bees! Boogie Bees! Jolly Dutch, and this is a game. Hey, Jesse. Bam! Yeah, and this is from the same company that brought you Chartered from a few months ago, right? Chartered? Yeah. 
Oh uh, yeah, the Golden Age, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. I remember that and one. So in this game was that the one that's similar to um a choir. The choir, okay. Yeah. Oh. Right. So in oh. this one, this is a bluffing game where you have your you'll be one of these animals, like a dog or a cat, kind of like Zootopia kind of animals. And you're trying to do is you're making formations in the sky, and you're trying to make these formations, but you you don't you don't know exactly how you're gonna make these formations because everyone's placing their cards face down, and then everyone's gonna reveal and see if you actually made those formations. People may bluff and break the formations, but you're trying to do is score the most for this game. I dig it. Yep. So this is gonna be on Kickstarter very soon. All right, Boogie Beasts. This has been. This reminds me of Zootopia. Mm -hmm. This reminds yeah, me. Of, the artwork reminds me of Zootopia. What was the, uh, what was the cake game? What Callie, you can do Batman because you know how to. You know that one. The cake one is called Frenemy Pastry Party. Friendly Pastry Party. Frenemy. Okay. Frenemy. Frenemy. <laughs> Frenemy. 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 Like a friend okay. enemy. Frenemy. Yeah. Good thing we we Mental. clarified that. All right, Batman the Animated Series. Uh, a fun cooperative Batman game where you get to play as one of the, you know, heroic characters. And we haven't even opened this one yet, but we've played it before. I did What's open really it, cool? and I, I, okay, I, well, I uh, put all the little houses. Um, the buildings are really cool. Also, I like how they stack together for fitting into the game. But you actually will get to place your, your character on top of the buildings and in different areas. And basically, there's a lot of bad guys that come out, and you've got to use your abilities and your dice. A lot of little dice for each character. Emma, and thank you very much. Another Patreon. I scored another dollar <laughs> do. Yeah! Yay! All right. Well, yeah. Continue, I guess. Uh, there's little masterminds, like Poison Ivy. You have to defeat them. Basically, you're trying to, yeah, just get everything out of Gotham City before it gets overrun. <laughs> Wonderful. Yeah. So it, it's a fun little game. Yeah. I really like this one. Uh, played a lot of Batman games lately. <laughs> Batman. A lot of Batman. And this yeah. one's shorter it's than quick. the other one. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's way quicker. It's under an hour. Yeah, it's very so quick. Good Eric wants to know if anyone here has played Catacombs. Yet. I have. I own it. Well, I haven't played it, but I own it. I have. I own Catacombs, and I own the expansion. It's all brand new, and I just set it all up, and I never played it. I was a chicken. Sounds like half my games, right? <laughs> I just own them. They're, they're in the background. Okay. I think we're pretty good here. We talked about Patreon and giving me money. <laughs> we talked <laughs> about uh, all the games that we've got here, and Arkham else will be playing after Brilliant. Uh, well, depends how long this one is, but we'll play it, play it for a while, at least I imagine. Yeah. Brilliant or enough. BS, which is a trivia-style game. And then we talked about the fact that next week, on Tuesday, I will be doing the next stream with the game Fickle. And you saw Fickle. Yes, I did. Did you play it? I didn't get a chance to play it, but I was oh, I have it here. Ahead. Maybe we'll try it after. Yeah. But, uh, okay. yeah, you can, uh, you can go ahead and... Uh, remind yourself somehow that next week it'll be on Tuesday. And then I'll be at Origins and we'll do all this kind of fun stuff. Okay, I think we're good. Let's talk about Brilliant or BS. Are you right? It's yes. on Kickstarter right now and the game is... Actually, it's already funded. It was funded on Kickstarter. Oh, but it is on... Website. So it is funded. It's already it's funded. It's already funded. You yeah, we just launched the it. actual website so you can buy it now. All right. Yes, so... So it's a trivia game, but it's not just about what you know. It's really about what you can convince the other players you know. So I thought she was going to say who you know. About trivia. <laughs> it's like an L.A. person? Is that right? what we're no, talking no. about? It's like if you don't know trivia, that's fine. You just have to pretend like you know the answers to things. So it's a bluffing game. It's, gonna it's help a bluffing me a lot. trivia <laughs> game, which is really cool. I like bluffing. Um, yes, I do too, which is why I came up with it. It's like I love anything where you kind of have to like just be creative and think on the spot mm -hmm. and try to convince people you know things that you don't really know. So, Do you guys like trivia? Do you yeah. like trivia so, night or I've good? played. I mean, yes. <laughs> what, what's it called? Um, oh, this really, really crazy trivia. And we played Zero, which is one uh, very interesting. I like that one. I Blockbuster too. The, I can't. Bezer Wizard. Bezer Wizard. Yeah. Bezer 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 Bezer. Bezer. Uh, that one is right, really, really right, hard. I like but I like that one a lot. <laughs> okay. All right. But uh, you got you to try and make a fan out of me, okay? Okay, yeah. All these right. I would say the questions range from like easy to Because I suck at trivia games. I like them, but I suck at them. You know? But that's what's great about this game. Is you, that you don't do have so to bad. be <laughs> so good at trivia, hmm. okay? You just have to be... It's like whoever is the best at pretending to know the most can win this game. You don't have to actually know the most. I mean, if any of this um, game sounds like your life, I, 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 I believe it, man. I believe it. Yeah. Okay. So the way it works is that you take turns being the judge, and the judge is going to read a multiple choice uh, trivia question. It has three multiple choice options, and everyone else has these ABC answer cards. So you're going to answer with the, what you think the correct answer is, but put your card face down so no one else can see. So if you think the answer is B, you're going to put B down. 
I watched no, the video before answer. the stream, so I knew this. So you so kind of have an idea. Just a little bit, though. Yes. And then each person's going to go around and explain how or why they know the correct answer, but they can't say any of the multiple choice options in their explanation. So you can say, I know this one because I learned this in elementary school. Duh. It's so easy. Everyone knows this one. So you're going to be kind of vague in your answer, but you're still trying to convince the judge that you know it because the judge has these two cards, a brilliant card and a BS card. The brilliant card goes to the person they think got the question right. And that person automatically earns two points. So yeah. your goal... Whether, you win or, whether you're right or wrong. Whether you're right or wrong. I like that. Your goal right. is to convince the judge to give you this brilliant card. Okay? Because you get two points automatically. Um, whoever they think got the question wrong is going to get this BS card. Nothing happens to you if you get the BS card other than we'll all laugh at you because you're really bad at <laughs> so that's So that's that. But also, if you get the question right, you earn one point. So the most you can earn is three points total. One for getting it right and two points additional for getting the BS card. Mm -hmm. Now as a judge, your job is to really figure out who got it right and got it wrong because you're going to lose points and gain points based off of your prediction. So if I give you the brilliant card and you got it right, yay, I get one point. But if I gave it to you and you got it wrong, I lose a point. And I get points. Yes, you get points for getting that brilliant card. <laughs> so All right. Trying, well, well, so just, I'm, trick... I'm being convinced now. Yes, okay. yes it's, a, it's a lot of bluffing going on. So. All right, I, li I like that. Who's okay. the biggest BSer in, in this group? Oh my God! No! <laughs> you can't point at me too. Everyone pointed at you. Okay. I, you can't BS a BSer. Okay. You can't BS a BSer. Well, we're about to find out. We're about to find out. All right, so let me pass out our ABC cards here to everyone. All right. And, and then how many remember? players is this ideal with? Ideal four. Let me say four to six, but you can play with yeah. three. Is this yeah. a lot more fun? I think with with um at least four players. <laughs> So Speaking of which, you guys ready to do some voting? You guys go ahead and vote for which one of us you think is going to win now. How many points do you usually do in a game? Well, it'd be doing it based off of rounds. So with how many people are playing with? One, two, three. I'm not going to play. I'm just going to No, block. you got to play with well, it. Well, because here's the thing. I know all the answers because I wrote all the questions. Yeah. That's true. So that would be yeah. cheating yeah. to let you yeah. play. That would be cheating to let me play. Yeah. Really? That does that? Mm. Yeah. So, so I'm so going to let you guys play. Play. Okay. All right. All right. What, I'll tell you what. I'll okay. play this for you and then you can play that one for me. Okay. That sounds good. We'll do that. All right. So you guys play and then I'll keep score and I'll just do like color commentary maybe, you know? All right. All right. And so in rounds, how many? How long is a round? So with four people, uh, so each round, each person gets to be the judge once. So with okay. four people, we usually do about twelve questions. Okay. Twelve to sixteen questions. So, so it depends on how many. So people are let's playing. let's but we're gonna still do it basically that. Let's so if you said twelve. Yeah, we'll say usually about twelve questions. So let's do uh, four, four, and four. Okay. And split it because that way we can have people vote three times. And the person oh, with the most yeah. points after each of the four questions, that, that that's the names that are going to go in. People can go ahead and change their votes and whatnot each of the three different times. So we'll put it, make it a little, a little bit of... round winner. Yeah, round winners round almost. Winner. Okay. okay, okay. You can do that. Absolutely. Do I already have some for Callie's crew? Nobody yeah. wants... <laughs> Pedro, you're already against me. Oh, Nobody's man. voting for me. Oh man. Oh, Stop, not this Callie's crew stuff. Thanks. Hashtag unfiltered gamer for me. Ferdinand, what's your hashtag? Um... You're not, where's your energy, man? Where's your energy? <laughs> Hashtag Ferdinand. <laughs> Hashtag Ferdinand. There we go. Okay. Well, for the, just for Ferdy. the real quick. <laughs> no, game, he doesn't like that. The giveaway game tonight is from Ferdinand, but it's yes. not Ice Cool 2. It is the original Ice Cool. Yeah. Yes, yes. It's not Ice Cool 2. Yes. I've yeah. got I've got some bonus giveaways, <laughs> too. Um, I'll have to go pull them out, though. And we're giving away Brilliant BS too as well. You're going to give away Brilliant yeah. BS? Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, and we're going to give away a game of, of this game specifically. So, yes. all right. Uh, all not right, this so one, but yes, well, but yeah. Yeah. this game specifically, <laughs> but not this actual physical copy specifically. You get, I, you get it. You understand. You understand. <laughs> all right, guys. So uh, we all have our little little, little things here. Everyone's got your ABC cards. Okay, so we're one, gonna have two, three, Callie, we're going to let you be the judge, be the judge first. first. You're going to start first. You're going to read that question. Right. Make sure no one can see there. See it? All right, and you guys play along at home too. You guys and can go I'll guide ahead. You, along. you guys can go ahead and see which one of us is right. No googling, no googling in you trivia games. No That's googling. not fair. You guys are cheating if you do. Stop it. Because I'm definitely not gonna look at the comments. You guys will let me win if wait, which might make might, might make them vote for me. All right, Gary. That's all right. You better pick me. You guys remember you have the choices to vote for any of us, and if you if you're right, we're gonna put you in the basket to to win a game, whether it be Ice Cool or whether it be Billion or BS. Okay. Let's All go, right. Gary. The topic is geography. Oh, no. And the question is, the famous running of the bulls is held annually in which Spanish city? A, Madrid, B, Pamplona, or C, Barcelona? <laughs> yeah, so we all, we all put down one of these guys now, right? So right. we've all put down one of these. Yeah, now, she doesn't... 
And she doesn't know what she doesn't know what you've put down. So now one by one, usually starting with the person to uh, clockwise to the left of the judge is going to go first and explain how or why you know the correct answer. Even if you don't, even if you're clueless, you got to convince her that you did. It's all over history books. Mm-hmm. They have it all over the place. Now she can say what she picked, right? No, no not yet. Not no, yet. No, we no. reveal at the end. So you're going to say. I put these first. Yeah, she's got to give up, make her prediction. So you guys will take turns explaining how or why. Mm-hmm. And I, then she's going to make I her know, prediction. I know this answer. Whether you believe me or not is up to you, but I know this answer. <laughs> okay. So this is one I've, I've known I, for a long I time. I think there's an obvious like answer to this, but I think it's going to be the one that's going to be a little less obvious. Now, as long as I get it right, I get points, right? Yes. Regardless of whether or not she picks me? Correct. If okay. you get it right, you get points, but you're, if you get that brilliant card, you're going to get two points, so that you're going to really... So I want, I'm trying to convince you're her. To convince I want her, her to pick me, because then I get three points now. Yes. Is that the most exactly. I can get in the turn around? That's the most is, you can get in the round okay. is three points. You did put it down really quickly. <laughs> it could have been strategy. Yeah. Could but I don't know been. if you were BSing about that. I don't know. This I get points either way, so. Yeah. Oh, yeah. wow. Okay. So Michael's and already then... got two points. <laughs> oh, BS oh, yeah. kind of. Okay. <laughs> All right, so if now you're going to say what the correct answer is, and the way it works is the person who did not get either one of those cards shows their answer first. And then the person who gets the BS card shows their answer. And then the person who gets the brand. So a little bit of a dramatic reveal. Okay. <laughs> All right. Perfect. So the correct answer was B, Pamplona. All right. Oh. For I, did, I did not do it. All right. Okay. So you were good to not give it to him? That's okay. I lost. I was wrong. Nobody, too. Got oh. right. <laughs> Nobody got it right. So your brilliant prediction was incorrect. Two points. Your BS for me. So your minus always, one. Do I always have to give out? You don't Sorry. always have to give oh. it out. So here's the thing. If you okay. think someone here. Okay. No one got it right. No one got it right. You can hold on to that okay. brilliant card. And if okay. everyone got it wrong, then you will gain two points. Oh. If anybody gets it right, then you would lose Confidence is king. Yes. So All since right. you're, you were right with your brilliant prediction, but wrong with your. So you were right with your BS, but yeah. wrong with your brilliant. Basically Basically, Correct. it's a wash. So you're at zero points yeah, for that as a judge, right. okay? <laughs> and Michael got it right, so he's got two points. Okay, so she's going to be the new okay, judge. Yes, yeah, so right? the new judge. All right. I like this. You guys, now, if you haven't voted yet, vote for one of us. You have Kelsey, Michael, Ferdinand, or Callie, any of which you can go and choose. And you guys are also able to... Uh, to guess as well along with us and let us know if you got it right or you not. You know what's really bad? We got a lot of people got it right. 90% of the people oh. got it right. Yeah. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah. 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 You, you guys should be happy that I BS my way into points. I'm yeah, the only person with points right now. Well, they said you're the best BSer, so we'll see. He is. I that's why you have to You tried to screw careful. me, didn't you? <laughs> hey, I'm just... Yeah, she's like, she's like, ah, oh, he's doing it for points. I'm like, quiet, <laughs> you! Be quiet! I'm winning here, okay? All right. In 10-pin bowling, how many strikes in a row do you need to get a perfect score? A, 10, B, 12, or C, 13? Say the, the answers again. A, 10, B, 12, C, 13. Okay. Okay, everyone's asking. Wait, which one's your, your card? His is there, his is there, hers is there. Okay, perfect. All right, so the person to your left, so I might go first. I went bowling a week ago with my cousin Ashley. I'm not that good at bowling. Not I'm guess. not I'm not good at bowling, but I've gone I've gone bowling probably fifty times at least. So if I don't know the answer, then you're in trouble. <laughs> well, I think it is gonna be the I can say the answer, right? No, 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 you, no, can't, no. Can't, say oh, any, can't, you can't say any of them. You're just trying to convince her. Oh. You can't say any of them. Well I well I I've been bowling for a while too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, but <laughs> if, you, if you see the board, you can see how many rounds there are in, in, in uh-huh. bowling, and you can actually figure it out that way. Uh-huh. And Callie? I haven't been bowling a lot, but I have a pretty good memory. Can we, make, can we attack I, each yes, other? Yes, you can totally Looks trash like talk. She doesn't one. ever bowl. I, I know, but I, I went remember last week. what She's the board... smarter than you are. But I remember what the board looks she like, the memory, screen, and right? the screen, and how many rows there are. Oh, God. <laughs> she said right. rose. You can always interrogate. You can ask more questions Round. if you need to. Round. Follow up questions. When's the last time you went bowling, Ferdinand? <laughs> December. Last week. <laughs> Rock yeah. and bowl. BS master. <laughs> <laughs> I went. Did I not go bowling? I know. I, I did. I, yeah, I show you pictures. And I also know that you sat there and watched because your I back did hurt. because my back hurt. But I still went. Anyway, you got you to pick somebody. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. See? Like, I, I don't trust you. You don't have to. You it doesn't matter. I think you're BSing. I'm oh. not giving anyone the brilliant card. Oh. Okay. All Are you right. sure? So you think everybody got it wrong? I'm pretty sure. Okay. What All was right. the answer? So here's the thing. If, right. One second. So if everyone yes. gets it wrong, you're going to get two points. But if anyone here gets it right, you're going to lose two points. 
Okay. Oh, you sure you want to do that? No points. Yeah, well, you'll be negative. negative. <laughs> it's not worth going negative. That's okay. Nobody voted for do me it. anyway. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what's the correct answer? The answer is B. <laughs> Come on. Oh! You could have got... Everyone you got, got it negative right. Negative three points. <laughs> That's okay. I All went, right. so I went last two, week. But everyone you get, got it There's right. ten, and then there's two more on the last... I never go below. <laughs> on the last one. B for Dude, bowling. I haven't been bowling since I was like 14. Yeah, Danny, you know what's up. Who else got it right? I haven't been bowling in like, I go all the time, but I never Drew, pay attention. Like, Danny. my score's always so bad that I never pay attention to like the yeah, last one. Yeah, I'm just like, really let's really get me out of here. You guys are getting this. All right. Uh, Michael needs There's people who are right. getting it, that's for sure. All right. Now. Now, another thing I've noticed too is you can actually put the wrong answer down on purpose. Absolutely. Which is Ooh. what I thought about doing. It's totally strategy. Like, because like it'd be like, I her. actually know the answer, but I could put ten or eleven or just whatever, to screw up the judge. just so that yes. they, she picks me because she knows for a fact I know the answer. But then again, I might not get any points. Right, and I you're not sure enough. that she might give you that brilliant card too. You you know yeah. you can risk that. Uh, in Peter Pan, what is the name of the youngest of the three darling siblings? I know this, and I hope. Oh, I have to tell you the answers yeah. too. <laughs> Please. Okay. All right. The first one is A. My personal name, Michael. B, Wendy, and C, John. The third one? C is John. No, what's the, the question? The, third the youngest oh, of youngest the of three. The okay. Michael, Wendy, or John in that order from A, B, and C. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? Michael is A. Wendy is B. But he did he just say what he said Michael Wendy Michael and John. Michael Wendy and John. A B C. Okay. Michael Wendy John. He did, yeah, he said that. Youngest John. of the three. Okay. Youngest Michael of the Wendy. three. Yeah. All right. All right, now you're up first. Um I saw I, I, I love there's a parody on YouTube on this and I love it and so I know exactly the answer. Kelly? We watched Hook like I don't know, four times together probably. <laughs> what what about a pen? <laughs> Oh yes, oh yes, oh never mind. I just watched it with Kira like a month ago. But so. no, it you do realize that Hook is Yeah, but there's the same characters are yeah, there. Yeah, it's in there. It's a sequel. Yes, it's a sequel. Not, spiritual. Well, However, not unfortunately, not baby, I've seen <laughs> Hook. Yeah. The Boo Box. I've seen yeah. Hook, and I can tell you for a fact There's that the there. younger sibling in Hook is, in fact, not the male character. It is the female because yeah. Hook has Pan as an old man, and his okay. son and daughter. Yeah. And the daughter is younger. Ferdinand, I know, knows this answer. But I know unless it. he screwed me. But I know. Okay. And I get more information about how much I like that series, or you know. That I think you're. I think world. you do know it. Yeah. But I don't know for a fact. This is for a fact. <laughs> You, actually, just in case you know the answer, I'm oh, guessing sure? you might not, but oh, I know he I does. Mean, Wait, so you, you think can, everyone here got it right? I think so. You can, you okay. can give me the BS But I'm going to give the brilliant here. Okay, great. So Ferdinand's got two points there, so now he's got your tied with, in first place for three points. How you, wait, 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 wait. Uh, well, okay, so... Yeah, you I got, got the brilliant card, and bowling. then you got bowling right. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so now he's he got the bowling right, and mm. you just gave him the brilliant card, so he also has three points All right. Now All he has right. a chance to get another point if he gets this right. Giving him too many points now. Yes, All right. you are. All, All right. right. So, what's, what's the answer? I got to tell you the answer. The answer is, of course, personally me, Michael. What letter was that? A. Hey, okay, let's see. I got A. Yeah. All right, I knew she right. knew it, but I was Good. pretty sure Here he you did. Because he was real quick on it. <laughs> and it wasn't like he tricked you. Know, he could have put B down really fast, but I just felt Ferdinand would, you know, us board gamers know themes, genres, that kind of stuff. Yeah. yeah. Hey, look at all these well, A's. You guys are all right. Drew, there. Walters, Eric, Carly, Lily, wow, Emma, Rue, Rue, no, that's C. Come on now, come on. Come <laughs> I on. think in the, in the Michael's actually the old So I scored, I scored what? You got two points just now because your it, prediction it, it was correct that everyone here so got three. So he got three points. I got two. He got three, you got two. So he's, you have five points now. But they're all old. But I was like, when you said Hook, He's still there. Wendy's still alive. I don't know if John is alive in that movie. But Michael's still alive. I have no idea, but they never Yeah, my mom. Marbles, I think. Yeah. Is yeah. My marbles. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But they both were so old. There's yes, no. Who knew that? Yeah. yeah. They don't really. They, they don't never really, really say anything about it. who was the oldest right. or youngest. Yeah. That's why I was looking at you like. Yeah, that was a date. Yeah, yeah. That's why I was like, I'm pretty sure she <laughs> I was knows. I'm trying to say how much I like the. <laughs> oh yeah. Story. Don't be voting for Ferdinand, guys. Come on, vote for me. I'm <laughs> oh winning. Five to yeah, four. Five okay. To four. We got okay, one more. Are. This is the last one here. In the category of science and tech, the electricity used to power like. 
electric cars is measured in what? Kilohertz hours, kilowatt hours, or megawatt hours. So A, kilohertz hours, B, kilowatt hours, or C, megawatt hours. All right, Callie, you're up first. Uh, <laughs> my, one of my employees just bought an uh, electric car. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, she did. Pa Paviana. It's, it, you mix the lying of the truth, you know. You mix the lying because we're on the live stream, you know. You mix the lie. You mix the lie with the truth. It's a good trick. <laughs> I live with an electrician. Oh. That's all I got. Okay. <laughs> like, I live with an electrician. That does like, union work. He does union matter. work. It doesn't matter. He does not he do. Still has to go to school the electricity he uses does not involve the electricity <laughs> used in an electric he car. He school every year. He's I, taking it, classes. The reason I know this he is can. because we literally had a conversation with a guy in a Prius discussing yeah. the electric car and what you needed to charge it. Mm -hmm. Very specific because we actually went to uh, the last con we went to, which was Arizona. No, not Arizona Game Fair. Uh, no, uh, Washington, we D.C. Washington, and I yeah. talked to the guy. Yeah. Oh, All right. Wow. And uh, yeah, I talked to the guy for like twenty five like minutes about months. about <laughs> electric cars. So couldn't stand it. Okay. <laughs> that was one of the that was one of the very main topics that's, I asked him. That's pretty convincing, I would say. Okay. I will I will I will trust you in that. I'll, I All will right. have to sorry give you this. Okay. All right. So Michael's running away with the score now. That's so now he's up to seven. He's got the brilliant card. You're gonna say what the correct answer is, and then you're gonna show your answer yeah. first. What's the correct letter? It is B. B. Oh, I had no clue. Oh, <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> All right. Like, Callie and Michael did you actually know right. it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I, I actually would. I actually don't know that. I know yeah. I need to an answer, but I actually don't know the. I just yeah. went for something. It's like, it's, as long as it's, you it's, it's good if it's yeah, weird. See, these, these yeah. questions are nice because they're like random things I actually know about. So that's, that's kind of nice, you know. It's, those it's always the ones that are like. You know, what was the 1985 soccer team that won the World Cup but lost a player due to a car accident? Like, what? <laughs> the, like very what? specific. Yeah, these are more like that general knowledge fun. questions. Van Gogh had a daughter and her name was Emile. What so, profession was it? Was she even in? though I've gotten <laughs> every question or... right, I'm not in first because I can't convince other people <laughs> that thing. I know what it is. You gotta be convincing. Yeah. All right, so what we've learned is Mike was very convincing. So now yeah. you guys know But I'm also strategy. right, except He's for also one time. Right, except for that one time. So now you know some strategy. If you think someone else here got it right, you might not want to give that brilliant card to Michael because he's already in the lead. So if you want to win, you got to think about who you're going to give that brilliant card to. So that's something to keep in mind, too, as you go on. All right, so the winner of that first heat was Michael with eight points. Ferdinand had four. Uh, three, well done. Three. Well done. You all are Lily, <laughs> Danny, Dan, Elizabeth, Emma, Ryan, Walters, Danny, uh, different Dan, and then Gary. Danny and Dan. Danny and Dan, yep. Thank you, guys. Ah, in the bag for you guys. You guys can go ahead and stick with the same votes if you'd like right now, or you can mix them up. <laughs> if, you, if you are not changing your answer from either Ferdinand or Callie, don't say anything. Where's my win? You. Where's my winning? You did it? Stick with you, me. Did it. you guys see my win right there? The, yeah, there it is. I see. Uh, yeah. Um, winning. If you guys are voting for Mike, or you're changing your vote from Ferdinand or Callie to somebody else, go ahead and say it. All right. And we'll continue with yet another okay. round. Yep. Are we, wanting, yeah, are we wiping the score clean? Yep. Keep going. Wipe right. it clean. Wipe them clean. There we go. So, Callie, you be the judge All first right. again. I'll do it again first. The topic is history. How many cards do you get in the game? Uh, there are 85 total in the pack. And it, we recommend it anywhere from like 12 to 16 per game. So it takes about 30 to 60 minutes. All right. In 1867, the United States of America purchased Alaska from which nation? A, Russia, B, France, or C, Germany? So which country did the U.S. purchase Alaska from? 1867. <laughs> Give me the listing of the, the countries. A, Russia, B, France, and C, Germany. Okay. All right, I picked Everybody mine. Was slow with that one. <laughs> I had to think about it for a moment. I want to slam this one down. <laughs> I'm, I, I'm, um, uh, okay, you gotta. Kelsey, so you're up, up first. first. Defend your answer. 
common sense <laughs> location on the map. <laughs> Oh, my turn. Yes. Um, yes. I went with common This sense. one, I know due to the fact that... Well, I can't say that. Hmm. Hmm. What can I say about this one? I mean, other than... I'm fairly certain I know it. I could be wrong. I could be wrong, but I'm almost... I'm very certain I know it. So, if that'll help. I could be wrong, though, so... I mean, there you go. You could pick, the t you could pick that or not. Well, just be remember that he has that habit of what she just said about... Oh, I don't know it, but he knows it. Well, one of the more Remember. famous purchases the U.S. did for for <laughs> land for land gain was the Louisiana Purchase. So you can eliminate that, and that was pretty obvious what country is that. So you eliminate that fact, you get a better. Uh, now I have a better chance of knowing the other one. <laughs> Those are actually <laughs> not related as far as the purchasing people involved. I know that for a fact. I give my card to Ferdinand. You actually, your best bet is literally me. <laughs> no, actually, I think... Uh, All right, so Kelsey... What did you say? Common sense? She was like, duh. Common uh, sense, location on the map, like... All right. I mean, All right. I'm shitty so, with a map, but... All right, so my answer is... Who his answer first? What's the, what's the correct answer? Who shows answer? it first? The correct answer is Russia. Russia. What letter a, was that? A, a, a for uh, I thought it was France because of the Canadian oh. French. Because ca Canada. Wait, oh, I, I put the wrong French answer. Canada. Oh. I put the wrong well, answer. Yeah, it, wrong. it was Russia. Oh, Fernie got it wrong. A, Yay. but Kelsey gets it right. And you were correct with your and brilliant A. There you go. Bad. Really bad with that. Yes. Wait, wait, but you said they purchased um, uh, Alaska, right? Yeah. U.S. purchased Alaska from Russia. From Russia. <laughs> Russia's all the way yeah. across. Yeah, the closest country to it. Think about <laughs> it. The closest it was China. there. It's next to Remember Siberia. Remember when Sarah Palin was like, I can see Russia from my house. French Canada's <laughs> way closer. <laughs> Dang you, French. Cool movies. Cool movies. Come on, French. France, what's up? All right, up? so yeah. Kelsey is like, look, off I'm to not, a hot I start can't believe three I three actually points. answered I'm that wrong. I'm not going to lie. Like, I'm horrible with a map. Like, I don't... I don't <laughs> That is not fair. I can point to a random place on the map right. and have no idea where I'm pointing. <laughs> that was geography, too. I'm horrible. <laughs> Callie's got two points, Yay. and Mike and Ferdinand have not scored yet. We'll see. Mm. That's right. I feel great. Wait, don't I get one for Ferdinand? Not yeah, you got two points oh. for that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Two points for... Entertainment. For <laughs> Name the band that seems, sings the theme song to the TV show Friends. A. Ben Folds 5. B. The Rembrandts. Or C. Bare Naked Ladies. <laughs> Do any of you guys watch Friends? Oh, but we'll see. No, it, it, it. <laughs> See, I know two of those bands. I know how they sound, so. <laughs> I know all three of them. And say them again, in order. Ben Folds 5, The Rembrandts, Bare Naked Ladies. Okay. <laughs> she hasn't even heard the explanations yet, and she's like, I'm going with Kelly. Go All right, go away with Mike's up first. Oh, go ahead. Well, I get to choose what I pick what I put. What I put. No, say what's your, your explanation, I guess. Go ahead. Oh, before. Um, you, can, she can, you might convince I know it's. I know it's, yeah. I know it's one of the po the two of the popular bands, and I know it's not the one that I really like, so I picked the other one. I know she knows the answer, and I'm almost positive I do, That's too. That's why I gave her the one. <laughs> I'm almost positive I do, too, though. Pat. <laughs> ah. <laughs> it's like you're always stuck in second gear. All right. I've probably watched the entire series. Yeah, so I have. I watched it with you. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Good answer. All right. So okay. Cal automatically gets. Two I go points. first now, right? And yes, flip you go over. first. So it was bare naked ladies. Absolutely not. Rembrandts then? Yep. Because that was what I didn't know. Oh. That was what I didn't know. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I got it wrong. Kelly got it wrong. Really? I, I was like, I, it didn't sound like Bare Naked Ladies, but I thought it was no, a popular I knew, one. I knew it wasn't C, but I wasn't sure. Ben Folds oh, 5. No. They, mean, they do brick and like, uh, and I, I thought I did the army. Wait, who'd you get the BS card to? Nobody. Nobody. So you thought everybody here got it right. I was... Uh, oh. Close, but how did you? What the? What is wrong with you two? Oh, no. uh, I was I was I pretty know. certain, but uh, you're down negative. Now you lost two points there, I'm so now you're down to one. The, I'm like Rembrandts. I don't know who that is. So. It's the Rembrandts. Come on. That doesn't mean Sorry, anything. Kelsey, <laughs> I'm trying I to think of any other songs that they It's Claude oh. Dawson from Glurbendurb. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. I know them. The 90s, right? The I know only one that I remember of those from the '90s was Rembrandts. Yeah. What? 
Well, Bare Naked Ladies. Well, what? Yeah, that was a trick question because Bare Naked Born Ladies does the theme song for Big Bang. Bang. Yes. yes. They do the nerdy science song. Oh, yeah. this mine? Yeah. Is this yeah. mine? I know all the words to the nerdy science song. Come on, Michael. Two in a row. They currently watch that. I know. I know. So I'm I'm not. This is not going well for me. I'm sorry, Eric. I'm not. I'm not doing. I'm not helping you. I understand why he did that because they watch Big Bang Theory. All right. Well, no, I know, I know Barry Naked Ladies as well. It's been one week since you looked at me. I know, I just couldn't remember. I, I, yeah. All right, um, where did ghost peppers originate from? Oh, come on, why couldn't <laughs> I literally grow these in the backyard? A, Mexico. B, India. C, the Caribbean. Ghost peppers and where they originated from. I noticed the backyard was not an answer. <laughs> <laughs> My backyard. Um, I know that would have made that one of the options. Now if, it, now, if they said Carolina Reaper, it would have been Florida. Okay, by, that's by Pepper. Um, what was it called? I was thinking of that. I yeah, was of yeah, that. it's that's yeah. the Pepper Joe. He did the breeding for that one. Anyway, that's not relevant. Ghost peppers is, and I know where this is. I know this answer as well. Hopefully, you're going to convince me that you know it. All right, Ferdinand. I, I have a pretty good feeling for this one too, since you know. Like chilies anyway. Hot he had a good feeling about the last one too. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I've, got a, I've got a good feeling about right. this. What do you got? I've got a good feeling based on where we get our plants from. Mm. You told me. <laughs> like, legit, you told me. Like, we we're talking about me picking things from the trees, and he's like, "Hey, I got some ghost peppers. They're from this place. Mm. You want some?" I'm like. Yeah, no. Uh, <laughs> remember like, having this conversation with her, right? No. He has a horrible memory. You yeah, can't you ask can't him a few other things. Nobody got it right. Uh, oh, you think oh, everyone got it wrong? Uh, he may have got it right, but he's just guessing, so it's a dangerous thing. It's not game. a guess. Give me, oh, okay, give so me the points. If everyone here gets it wrong, you're going to get two points. But if anyone here gets it right, you're going to lose two points. I will? Yes. So you got to decide. Really? Uh, you should take my word for it. You told me we had this conversation. <laughs> I don't remember this. Th I do not remember this. You could be lying to at me. At least twice. Urgh, I, oh, I think you know the man. answer, but did you pick the answer? If I lose points, I'm going to be so mad. So Fernand's got two points for getting the brilliant card. All right, so Kelsey's going to show her answer this, first. This, what what is the correct wait. answer? What letter? Be India! Please be India! You were wrong! <laughs> I knew it! I knew it! You all suck! <laughs> I'm like, I really don't think anybody knows this. Oh, uh, it's uh, Caribbean. Uh, I was close. No. I don't remember having that conversation. I Mexico, don't remember baby. Where they said they were from. Baby, Mexico hey. has very specific chilies. Anyway, oh. I, every, uh, well, Trey, Lily, why are you on my were team? You're right about your BS prediction. You're wrong about your brain prediction. So you still have zero points. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't right. This ain't right. <laughs> I two. knew it. That's Callie so dangerous to not pick one. somebody. That's okay. Uh. <laughs> Yes. Nobody okay, voted ready? For no, <laughs> I'm not ready. Oh, here we go. Geography. All right. Oh, I'm good at this one. KLM is the national airline of which country? A. Germany. B. France. C. The Netherlands. KLM is the national airline of which country? A. Germany. B. France. C. The Netherlands. Hope you guys been traveling to Europe. I have. I went to Scotland <laughs> last month. Crap. All right. That's kind of close, right? <laughs> kind of. Callie's up. Oh, oh wait, she's in order again. Yet. It is A. Germany. B. France. C. The Netherlands. Uh, no looking. I picked first. Already picked. All right. Okay. I may not know airline. But I know of some cities in the different countries and what letters they might start uh, having them. Hmm. <laughs> Guess. 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 Like, I could um, be right and I could be very, very wrong. <laughs> I am. So I didn't know the answer until after you said the three areas. And I know two of them. And that is not from those two. So it's obviously the other one. I'm almost positive. How is that obviously the other one? Are oh. there no numerous airports in different countries? Or yes, does, like, are. France have one airport? 
I I know. Just saying, I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm fairly certain on mine. He thinks there's only one airport in these countries. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm I'm fairly certain on mine. I'm gonna take a long shot. That is oh, oh, long shot, Kelsey. You, you, you done goofed. <laughs> Two more points for Kelsey. You done goofed. I have, I have what are you doing with that BS card? My mom travels, but like, yeah, yeah. I could be so wrong. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, Kelsey. Got to get All right, so All right. then it's me now. Yeah, you're gonna show your card first. It's What's the, the correct Nether answer. Uh, what letter it, is it? It's the Netherlands, it's right? The Netherlands. Yeah. See the Netherlands. Oh, I'm like, I'm like, there's a bunch of, I'm like, it's not France and yeah, Germany, there's so. There's a bunch of, bunch of cities in there that start with K, so that's why I guess that one. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> all right. So that's oh, a let's point see how you guys did. Point for Mike, Man, and look at all these the damn C's. Your BS and your what boy position was, were wrong. What did I get for this? You guys are crazy. You got the boy part, so you got two points there. Well done. So now you're at three. Ooh. And <laughs> that's, <laughs> and, and that's oh. all of them, right? Uh, that's it for this round. Yes. That's it for this round, yeah. So you guys would play two Who got the most? So that Callie won with five. Yay. Kelsey had three. Mike with one. Walters, with Brian, zero. Vinny, Jesse, Sorry. Colton, and Rue. Well Thank done, you, guys. Thank you, Callie's crew. Congratulations. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, so if you good evening, changing, Caitlin Hagen. I will write your name down. To All one right. Second. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Share it out. Give yourself entries in to win. Ice cool and brilliant or BS. If you're changing your vote for Michael or Ferdinand, let me know. If you're voting for Callie or myself, let me know. Other than that, if you're if you're staying with Michael or Callie, got a got a little. <laughs> it's thing. okay. I got you already. All right. All right. Over fireworks. Final round. Final round. Final round. Final round. All right. Ooh, glad I didn't get. This Thank one. you, Gary. <laughs> <laughs> because the category is sports. <laughs> In these two sports, if the ball touches the line, it is considered good. Welcome and to the show, Caitlin. So each one has two sports. A is volleyball and tennis. B is football and tennis. C is basketball and baseball. Now, we'll go so ahead. So, in which two sports does, if the ball touches the line, it's considered good? Like good, good in it's play. In play. In play. What's, what, what's, well, and what were the ones what is, again? A, volleyball and tennis. B, football and tennis. C, basketball and baseball. All right, Kelsey. Kelsey. I actually would have slammed this one down. <laughs> Dude, I don't do sports. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> We're going to go with what I said to Ferdinand last round. Yes. 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 <laughs> I'm fairly positive. <laughs> <laughs> Notice when he says fairly positive, he's usually wrong. Just yeah. saying. You might have a tail. Hmm. No, I saw it was fairly positive in the Netherlands. And everybody's like, yeah, yeah, yeah blah, 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 blah. She was making all this stuff That's up. And, yeah, and, and, and. that was weird for right <laughs> <laughs> I, I couldn't help myself. Uh, I do know I a bit about sports, point, right? specifically yeah. these two. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. um, I know I will be half right. So <laughs> 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 you think you know one for sure? Yeah. I'm I'm very positive for one. I'm kind of positive with the other. <laughs> oh, you guys make it so difficult. <laughs> you would actually. Who would you think among us three knows sports? I've admitted that I don't. So who yeah. among those two? No sports. <laughs> the person I don't know. Do I happen to have signed baseball memorabilia he, everywhere uh, and yeah. basketball you and volleyball? And you can choose to hold on to one. But that's, I think someone got it right because even if you just guess. <laughs> <laughs> Even if you just guess. I, I mean, what did I play in college? What did I play in high school? Things. You wrestled. <laughs> Not these flights. Like, <laughs> no, no, hey, she's like, none of the ones on really? this list. <laughs> Not any of them. But in college. <laughs> in college, what did I play? Okay. Okay. Oh! <laughs> okay. All right. Mike's on the board with two points. I a point. <laughs> All right. So you're going to show your answer first. Yes. What's the correct answer? What A, letter? volleyball and tennis. All right. Fernand. Oh, yeah, okay. okay. I told you I didn't know. Right. You're and welcome. I, I chose the wrong answer. Sorry. Two oh. points for me. Oh. I did. I did know the answer I though. Playing volleyball. I, 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 no, I knew the answer, but, but I figured these two would guarantee to not know it. 
Yeah. So I, I was exactly guaranteed. I was almost guaranteed this card. Yeah. So. I'm nice sorry. I thought there. someone would at least guess though, so I should get rid of it. <laughs> I figured that they both didn't have a clue. Yeah. yeah and I was like, I'm like. That's a wash. Yeah, That's I, I, I played I played volleyball in in college though, which is why yeah. I tried to throw that yeah, to you. And then yeah. I picked baseball and basketball. <laughs> <laughs> dirty. I need like the it. points. I need the points. <laughs> That's right. I'm working with you guys, Danny. See, I, I got all these people that want to win some games. I'm here to help <laughs> you out. Evil. Okay. This is just mm -hmm. wrong. Okay, science and tech. In terms of air conditioners, what do the letters B T U stand for? A British thermal unit, B, base temperature unit, or C, butane transfer unit. What? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I just installed an air conditioning unit. In my, well, not just now, but I, I installed an air conditioning unit, so that's about as much information I have for you. <laughs> It's still one that sounds like science. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's that would be my that was my thought processes on the matter. Uh, I watch a lot of HGTV. <laughs> not a bad. Not actually, a bad yeah, stuff I, I would there. actually yell, but yeah. I like that. Uh, that yeah. was better one than ours. So. <laughs> like that. But uh, <laughs> how sciency? Um, uh, you can't be giving away the answers yes, now. Yes, I can because they're all sciency. Uh, no. Objection! Obje <laughs> objection! <laughs> 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 objection! Um, uh, almost a lot of mostly science. <laughs> you guys suck. I'm. You should choose me if you actually want to get it. I don't think they. I don't think they have a clue. I think I am fairly certain. You I think. Anybody who I mean, right? you could pick nobody. Like. I'm sorry. I'm, I, I, I'm not being mean. I'm not being mean this she's time. She's trying to get points. And he's, he's Michael. Like you don't need more explanation. I'm being. I'm being nice this time. I'm, this is me actually giving you the Last right answer. Last time you said that to me, I got eliminated from games. Yeah. I don't trust. I didn't you. specifically mess you over like I did to Callie though. If you pick me, he might I, do it. I again. want the point. I but might. What are you doing, Clay? <laughs> He was doing his lie smirk. No lie smirk. Who, lie look at this face. He has a lie smirk. All right, we got to pick somebody. Go ahead, pick somebody. Who are you going to pick? Or pick nobody. No, nobody. Or nobody. Pick nobody. Pick, <laughs> give me BS. Please <laughs> give me BS. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Who do you think got it right, Kelsey? It could be nobody. Who are you going with? Right. It could be nobody. You can leave that there. You won't get mind, minus some points. Some are playing strategies. So. <laughs> could be wrong, but... Yeah, I just don't trust Michael. No, Michael. <laughs> <laughs> I think Kelly's just... Me she might be wrong, <laughs> like, though. Okay. Right, that's two points for Callie. All right. Got the brilliant card. So Mike's going to show his card first. What's the correct answer? A. British thermal units? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got that. <laughs> All right. I was, I was pretty positive. Thank you. Ah! Oh, Callie did I not. I tell you. Right. I tell you these things. I do. I show you the card and I place it down. Yeah, uh, we, I, when I installed it, it actually talked about <laughs> British thermal units. I thought that was very weird. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, like, why is that yeah. there? That's a good question. Um, see how I'm saying, like, how sciencey? Because right. thermal sciencey, mm -hmm. temperature sciencey. Science so yeah. I only got one you point even got the right answer. She got more points because she actually she got the brilliant card. Yeah, Sneaky. she was convincing there. Uh -huh. All right, but Sorry, I couldn't do lead. more. I'm, I'm trying. Well, like Mike's I said, Michael is Michael. So it's very hard to vote for him for anything. And Callie, HGTV. Oh. I'm not listening to you. Anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Caitlin voted for me if you didn't Good put her, her down. Yeah. Mike. She picked Team Michael. And that means I'm you can win. Sure All right. Did. The Tickle Me Elmo craze occurred during the holiday season of what year? The Tickle Me Elmo, during what year did this insane demon oh, spawn <laughs> from the pit of darkness uh, show up on your televisions to warp little children's minds? Uh, A, 1993. B, 1994, and C, 1996. Please place your answers down now. A, 93, B, 94, and C, 96. What do you guys what think at home? What do you guys think at what home, huh? What was the full question? It started on TV or became a thingy? I just when very popular, occur? like yeah. When I guess like well, every, there's like season. magazines and holiday season. Yeah, what Christmas year? season? What Christmas season were they? Come on, where are you going? Where are you going? All right. I remember. Uh, 
I remember times. Oh, listen. All right. I remember this because I got one. Oh. <laughs> the demon spawn. You picked <laughs> yeah. up one of those things. Please hug me, and then let me take the blood of innocence and wash it <laughs> over my body. <laughs> like, that's not how I remember it. Yeah, that's how I remember it. Tickle me, <laughs> and then let me scratch out your eye sockets. <laughs> oh my, my younger sister Zoe was Elmo crazy, <laughs> so I remember her crying about this. <laughs> I don't think she got one. <laughs> she was not lucky. No. I remember getting one my mom. My mom got me one one year when they were actually, you know, okay. And uh, my dad ran it over with the van like a month <gasps> later. <laughs> mm. On purpose. Oh <laughs> Like, on purpose. It was intentional. It was. No, it was. You don't understand. It's kind of funny how this toy has brought back memories. <laughs> it's, right? it's, yeah. it's okay. We had I never band. owned it or no, ever we had even a band saw that one. down in like 90, 94, and he, um. he left my Barney. I had one of those talking Barneys. He left it in the van, and the, the people at the, the car place All right. stole it. All right. <laughs> All right, team. Yes. Internet, what do you guys think? I don't, I don't know. You guys. You know. Knowing your sister's age, it's very convincing to me, but you could be full of it. <laughs> you could be so full of it. I mean, I was just you lying. should get this right. Unless you, are you not, Are you lying to me? No. You should get this right. <laughs> she didn't lie to me. I'm, I'm certain <laughs> she should know this. I don't know about you two. This, Tickle Me Elmo was not necessarily my... I, mean, I guess it was close to my generation. 96, I would have been five and a half that Christmas. You can't Ooh, say the answer. You can't answer. say any of the answers. You can't say any of the multiple choice I answers. I mean, well, yeah. two, three, four, two, three, five. Two, can't, three, I can't pick you now, but I'm definitely okay. not going to pick put the BS on you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm actually just going to go with my first gut, even though I don't know. And then for Ooh. this one here, Callie, I don't know for now. No, no, I, 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 I would take that back. Oh! <laughs> okay, I believe him. I believe him. <laughs> He's he's like he's like yeah. yeah I'm he's all it. serious about now, it. Now if I don't like, give if I don't give this out, what happens to me? So if everyone gets it right, then you get two points. But if anyone here gets it wrong, you're gonna lose two points. So you have to make sure everyone here you think everyone here got it right. If you don't give out that BS card to someone. Oh. All right, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, <we're laughs> I, I trust right. him more now. Okay. So you should know it, but too. he seems he he said he owned one, so we're going. All right, All right, so, so you're going to show your answer first. What's the correct answer? 96. That was C. Oh! Actually, you saved me! Actually, Good I did be. Yes, I didn't own one. No! <laughs> you knew the answer? I knew the answer. Uh, my, da my, legit, my dad ran it over a month later. How did you know the answer? <laughs> because it was so popular. I was I was second grade. Because uh, Zoe, that would be more her year yeah, to own mine, it. Yeah. So I, I believed you for a moment. Uh -huh. I'm like, well, she picked the highest year at least because Zoe's younger. But then you, 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 you have you guys gone to the? I know when this was popular, but have you guys gone to the store when they were there and you just put you just push everything? <sighs> you just had them all going. Yeah. I, was, I, I was that was that was um. So how many points are we all at? What are we at? What? You're at five. Good job sh changing your answer at the last minute because that just got you two more yeah. points. Fernand's got three. Callie's got two, and Kelsey's got one. Yay for one! Yeah, you guys Yay. wish you would have not change your vote, huh? All right. All right. Fernand, this is the last this one last for you. Last one. Here we go. Oh no! It's Let's my go, turn. Fernand. Oh no. You can do it. Okay, here we go. All right. All right. 37 I, I people. Like this subject. Let's Food go. And get drink. them up. <laughs> if you haven't commented and you're watching, comment so we can get you into the raffle. It's free. Just comment. Well, okay, here and we go. And then support me on Patreon. One dollar. <laughs> One dollar. <laughs> Mikey ahead, says fine. hello. Mikey, support me on Patreon. <laughs> what meat was the main ingredient in spam when it was first invented in 1937? A. Beef. B. <laughs> Pork, C, turkey. When it was first invented? What meat was the main ingredient in Spam when it was first invented in 1937? <laughs> A, beef. B, pork. C, turkey. Okay. True story, I've never had Spam. 
It's really? horrible. It's, it's, yeah. it's delicious. It would, it's a horrible thing. Have, <laughs> have spam with sous vide and it's, go to Hawaii. Uh, it's yeah, cheap. it's like yeah. Yeah, Hawaii, yeah. Hawaii, right? Yeah. yeah. You, you guys seen the it's uh, the Christmas okay. story yeah. where the little rice. kid is driving around on his bike rice, yes. and he's trying to get that dollar from the dude for the have you seen that the movie with what's it called the Christmas story a Christmas a Christmas yeah. story yeah, a Christmas and the guys story. the kids driving the bike trying to get the dollar from the guy <laughs> for his magazine or the guy's like trying to dodge him the, the dude's like give me my dollar <laughs> <laughs> okay um, making my answer based on the meat that's most popular at the time and in the locations that you said. <laughs> okay. I'm with her. <laughs> it's the cheap, it was a cheap meat then. I, think about it. It was That's a scary th think about now. it. <laughs> She's throwing it on you. Like you don't need to think about it. You know the answer. Spam now is what? Four dollars a can? It's a, it's a, yeah. if, as long Back as it's canned meat was super cheap. It's like buying corned beef, you know, twenty years ago. Mm. It was cheap. As long as as long as the answer is the same as it is now, then I might. As long as I, because I've eaten it, so I know what's in it. But as long as they haven't changed it since I then, I know what it is. It's kind of gross. It doesn't help your case. <laughs> as long as it hasn't changed uh, since then, I, I don't know see, what it was see, like. If back I then, give but... you, I know you're right. <laughs> if I give you this, I still would lose. So I have to go with someone else. Mm, there you go, playing strategy but, again. But but I think I think <laughs> everyone I think everyone has a all the good all good answers. So okay. well, give me the BS yeah, one. I'm Callie. keeping BS. Okay, that means you think everyone here got it right. Yes. Wait, so Callie's up to four points now because she's got that BS that brilliant card. So if everyone here gets it right, you're gonna get two points. If anyone here gets it wrong, you're gonna lose two points. <laughs> oh. Yeah. All right. So <laughs> you're gonna say what the correct answer is, and then everyone's gonna reveal. It is of course. Just be spam. Spam is ham. Yep. Ham. Yay! <laughs> yeah. right. so I, 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 it's spicy ham. It's portmanteau, yeah. right? Yeah. It's, yeah. it's been ham. It's spicy, so it's spicy spam. ham. That's what it means. Mm -hmm. Spam. Spam is spicy ham. Spam is All right. Ham. So here are our scores after three rounds. Ah, six points for me. Mike in the lead with six points. Uh, he takes that. Ferdinand and Kelly are tied with five. And Kelsey, two points. Celebrate good times. Ooh, Come on. You guys are so. You guys are so. In the box. You guys should have chosen me. You get so nothing. Close. See, you guys are good and fun for me. I'm going to go gonna away. <laughs> you guys didn't win. And then, Eric, sorry. Oh, we're going to play another game, though. Oh, game of what? Another game, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. So if you guys like okay. Brilliant so or yeah, BS, so that's uh, if you guys like Brilliant or BS, you can go ahead and take a look at yeah. www.brilliantorbs.com. Yes. Yes. And actually, we have a, a promo going right now. You get 10% off using launch using the promo code LAUNCH10. So you save 10% nice. from now until and you the end of the you month. You have to give, 10. you know how like the, the big sponsors, they do it for the people on the YouTubes where it's like, you could put in our name on the code thing and we'll give you 10% <laughs> off when you come to the stream. So you're supposed to do that. So it's launch 10 instead of unfiltered. All right, launch 10. Remember that one. <laughs> if you would have told us, we could have put it on the screen as a full-on oh, picture. Sorry, yeah. yeah, that's all right. I forgive you. Next oh. time, everyone to save that 10%. Well, <laughs> okay. that's right. I do. I want to save you money. Because then that 10% can go into money for me for, for Patreon. Patreon. <laughs> $1. Come on. Come on. <laughs> all right. Arcanos. You guys want to play some Arkanos? Let me buy IDW. Uh, this one is a fun little game. Fun little game. Thank you, IDW. She's playing with us now. I know, right? Uh, I know, nice. you're dodging it. All right. But it's still K. It's, it's okay. okay. We're switching. Are you going to play? No, you're playing. Oh, I'm yeah, playing. Okay. Uh, so I've never played before, so you've got to have to do this yeah, It's very easy. Yeah. Okay. Who wants to be what, what color colors? Ooh, can I do blue? See, she even took my color. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> me and you are happy. Are you always blue? No problem, Lily. Glad you enjoyed the game. If you guys did get a game from me at some point, let me know right now in the comments. Tell me that we got the game sent to you. And if you, we haven't sent it to you, message us on Facebook. I'm doing everything I can to make sure everybody gets stuff. It's a, a lot of work on top of the a lot of, already a lot of work. I've had like four videos that went out in the last day or so in, in addition to all this extra stuff. Uh, so please let us know if you have not even given our, your address. There's a couple of you who haven't. I know Kelsey's like begging to say something, so go ahead. Yes. There was a couple people that were asking me about um, some of the sponsored streams. Um, I think it was 524 Labs and Breaking Games. I have passed along your addresses. They yeah. will get your games out. If you have not already received them, they will get them out as soon as they can. Um, 
I can double check on a few of them for you. But other than that, like they're not, Michael is not sending those out. So um, if you have not received that yet and you're just curious, uh, let me know and I can, I'll okay. talk to whoever. Yeah, yeah I, 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 I'll talk to them. I, I, I'll get, I'll get yeah. all of them. But yeah, yeah, if you haven't gotten stuff from other people that are sponsored, just let us know. We'll do our best to make sure it gets yeah, to you. Know. Just don't blame us. We're doing our best. Yeah, I've gotten a couple messages. Like, yeah, yeah, you know. It's, just, about it, well, it's so okay. Just, just let us yeah. know. So all you gotta do is you're gonna put your little dudes here, just like this. Yeah, like that. You got a little red or dudes. Or however you want. However you want. <laughs> <laughs> and then you got these pieces here. These so uh, they're basically these are basically towers, right? So it's called the towers of Arkanos because you're basically gonna be building towers. You ever played Sagrada before? Sagrada. Huh? I'm not. You, okay, Ferdinand's played Sagrada. You played this before, Ferdinand? Yeah, I, I played this. And you this, played this as well. Yeah, this. Mm -hmm. Oh, I had to leave. That's why. Okay. So we shuffle these these. Oh, these, you lost by the way. I did. How did I lose? I wasn't even. I played one round. Well, yeah, we just kept you there. You. Yeah. But didn't build for you at all or yeah. anything. So you lost. You didn't win, so therefore you you lose. <laughs> That's not very nice. <laughs> That's not fair. I wasn't there. I was playing Werewolf. I had to switch. If you guys haven't seen uh, International Tabletop Day, we had a bunch of designers and stuff like that. We were playing Werewolf. Uh, you were there. Yes. But yes. you didn't play. I didn't play. You Werewolf. saw us. I saw. I saw. Yeah, it was play. very intense. <laughs> and they had like 20-something people yeah. playing, so it was a lot of fun. Um, but anyway, you can go ahead and check that out at uh, Tabletop Takeover's uh, Facebook page. If you want, I mean, it's up to you. Okay, so how do you make this? So you're going to have the little purples here. Then you're going to flip over all the out outside ones. Is it the same for three, is it same for still the three towers? Yeah, yeah, yeah it, does, it doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah. Okay. The only difference in this game in a four player and a three player game is in this game, you actually will draw five dice uh, around instead of four. Oh, okay. okay. Um, and for voting, we have Michael, Ferdinand, Kim, and Callie. Michael, if you want to win. I've won this game every time so far. Ferdinand, okay. if you yeah, want to, him, if you think he's going to win if I leave somehow during this stream, that's the only way, apparently. We can, we can make him crawl over. Uh, the underdog is always a good choice yeah, as well. Yeah, beginner's luck here. That's, there's a lot of power in beginner's luck. And then Callie is the puzzle Callie gamer. Crew. Callie is the puzzle gamer, which I'm actually usually terrible at these games, but for some reason, this one I'm okay at. He was playing simple. against me and Grant earlier, so that doesn't count. So what? I'll let you guys know my first game, I lost horrible. So I, I learned a lot from that game. So I, I yeah. <laughs> All right, so I need you guys to vote. Vote for one of us four. Vote for one of us four, and we'll get your name in, and we'll put you in the basket if you win along with us. It's a quick little game here. I think you'll have to have some fun. Grant, tee me, if you will, good sir. My Both tees, yes. My voice is dry. It's like <laughs> sandpaper. All right, so we've gone ahead and set the board. This is the middle. The middle doesn't do anything when you place die, except it'll give you a special ability, and then you score points when you put die on these tiles here. Okay. So let me show you how it works really quick. Everybody can learn. It's really quick. So at the beginning of the game, er, uh, the first round, uh, let's say I started, right? I would take these uh, five dice, and I'm going to roll them. After I roll them, I'm going to choose one and assign it to, to any... Ooh, thank you, T. Oh, and thank you, additional T. Alright, now, I'll, I'll hide this for later. And then I'm going to assign them uh, on the boards based on what die are allowed to go there. So in this case, this is a red symbol in the middle here, and it says a not equal, so it's any red that is not the same as another red. So if there's a one red here, I can play a two red here, and then I can play anything that isn't a one or a two on here. Does that make sense? Yes. So anything there. Okay. Over here is going to be a purple one, three, or a five, mm -hmm. and then this is any blue that is one or two. Here's a while, which means you can place them in any location. So uh, I would place one, Ferdinand would place one, you would place one, Callie would place one. The last one would go onto the board over here. In which case, uh, we, every time somebody places a die, I'll check to see if, if a tower gets built. And sometimes towers are going to be built like that after it's finished. In addition, when you place your die, you're also going to put down your little meeple along with the die. Okay. Because at the after building, uh, so let's go ahead and show you, after building uh, the portion of the tower, for instance, in this case, You'll look and check to see who has the most power on the area. And I have two red there, and Ferdinand has one, so I would score first place, and he would score second place. Tells you on here which ones are more valuable. In the middle here, it's less valuable to score uh, in a for a basically area control here. Uh, it's it's first place is three, second place is two, and ties are one. But on the outside areas, it is first place is six, second place is four, and ties are three. Got it. Each of these meeples is worth one point. And this little special meeple here is the cultist or the, yeah. the super high priest. He the is wizard. worth two. The wizard. The wizard, the wizard <laughs> of Oz. So in this case, if I had if I had like like this, so I had this guy here and this one, that's two plus one is three, and this is one. Right? Okay. And also if it was like this, I would have two, which means I beat these two out. But you guys tied, which means you guys are gonna get four points. Okay. 
okay? After that happens, you're gonna take one of these guys and put it up there, okay? So you guys get those back. Now, there are spaces on the board, and the space on the board are pretty simple. There's three main ones. The first one is a meeple, and that's a little, little meeple symbol. That means you take one of your meeples, and you put it down on one of the six areas on your board here to do a special ability at any time on your turn. You can do as many special no, abilities as you one, want. You put it on the other bases, right? Oh, no. Or, oh, okay. I'll get there. Um, or instead of putting it here, you can choose to put it on another space to, to block it. it. When you put it on another space, you don't get the value, the special bonus, but you do get control of an area, right? Okay. When, the, the, okay. when you guys are on there, they don't come off. Um, this is worth two points, and this is worth one point per stacking level, because as you know, they're going to start stacking up higher and higher. The round, the game is over after round nine for three players and eight for four players. Okay? Okay. okay. And that's the basic idea of the game. We'll continue. Um, whenever you play this here, there is, of course, the lower scoring after this gets stacked up, but mm -hmm. also you'll have the option of putting it either on your board here or taking one of your guys and putting it somewhere else for area control. Okay. okay. So, Mikey has voted for Kim and said that Michael must lose. <laughs> it's, it's his best friend, my roommate. Okay. Michael must lose. How are you doing, like Sandbox I'm guys? assuming that Brilliant or BS is going to be Nick. That's Nick. Okay. Thank you. Nobody's voting for Callie, huh? No. No Callie's crew. She's playing. She's playing, guys. She's playing, guys. Yeah. That's okay. I'll yeah, vote for her. You for the two rounds. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. One, two, three, four, and one more. I was just laughing. And that then, one. oh, and then Mikey says, tells me not to cramp my hand. Oh, okay. So That's nice. not relevant. It's but it's, it's, it's not relevant. All right, no. here we go. Not good, roll, Too late. Michael. That's right? that's good for me. Okay, so <laughs> I'm going to go ahead. Sandbox. Wow, you guys are in trouble. So I'm going to take this one here along with this here, and I'm going to place it on this little guy right here, and that is going to net me no points, but it will let me take my guy and place it on a three here, or I could use to place it on any of these any of these spaces here. All right, Grant, I can place it basically anywhere. I'm gonna go for the three. Let's me flip a die if I want. All right. I think yeah, I'll Sam. take this, and since there isn't any viable places to put it, I'm gonna put it here to grab us to make a spell in my sandbox. Table. Gaming is voting for Callie. Yep. All right. I will take my wizard and use a four, place it here, and get the four spell. Okay. Ooh. And that's. Wait! 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 Why is there two left? I went, Ferdinand. Oh, you skipped. Oh, you skipped I'm sorry. Her. Yeah, I'm, I'm like, sorry. I, wasn't sure if I, was <laughs> I forgot that you're playing now. Take the four from okay. her. Um, Use a wizard too. <laughs> Use a wizard too. <laughs> Make her pay for taking your turn. Oh, there you go. Take the four. But for all and she, you put it, she it in the middle. It. That's the only place you can play is in the middle. Okay, because yeah. this is uh, not equal to red, so this is three, so you can't place a three here. And then, of okay. course, there's one, two blue, and one, three, five. That's okay. okay. Kelly can still then, take a four. Uh, well, then you can put your, your meeple yeah. on there. What is this, four? There. So you put on four there. Mm -hmm. and then the four, okay. yeah. So that means yeah. the you can Was use... That yes. Yeah, so this means you can use your guy... This is easier to read. Yes. That one specifically ah, okay. says that you can change your col color of a die to any color you'd like. Ah, I like that. Okay. All right, Callie, you're up. Yeah. So if you're stuck, you can do use it. Do the same okay. thing. Oh, yeah. right, Vinny. <laughs> I like this side better because I know what they do already. So. Okay. Whatever you like. So now we score the middle. Yep. So we have two points for blue and two points for green. And then we have one point for yellow. What the heck happens in that case? We tie. We tie for you tie for first, mm -hmm. so you both get three points. No, we we tie. We take the tie, and Ferdinand gets nothing. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, that's I'm sad. That's so sad. <laughs> that is miserably sad. I like that. One I point know. each, and but Ferdinand gets nothing. Wow, I made out, I made out like a bandit in this one. Yeah. Okay, and this so now that this is filled up, this little tower is going to go on top of it just like that. Okay. With the so this like, this will happen. Give now, me the, give if me that advice, that if all these got filled, <laughs> you actually take this and flip it over and place it on top. Okay. Of these outside areas. All right, you guys should vote for me. I'm doing spectacularly. Ooh, oh, I think I'll take this one. Says the one with no points. See, this is a uh, blue one die. So I can put it here. Mm. I'll do it, put the one on two, so I can get two points immediately. Mm. Should do a GoFundMe for Ke uh, Kelsey's um, for, my, for me getting carpal, carpal tunnel. tunnel. <laughs> yeah, Vinny said we need to add that to the Patreon site. Mm. So. so this one has a one, three, or a five for purple. 
I do this. You can choose now to either take another meeple on the col on the number. You could choose to gain one point or to gain two. I would give. This will give two you points, points, right? I want oh, you two. want points. Yeah. You want two yeah. points? points. Okay, so you go put that there, and you put the meeple right next to it. I get my two. Yep. Yes. Uh, yeah. Boop. Awesome. Thank All you. Right. All right. All right. I will. I'm going to use my um, ability. Use your die as if it was any other color. And I'll use this uh, five. I'll use my die. Five as a. Uh, the yellow five is a purple five? Yep. Are you doing the meeple or are you doing the. I'm the doing point? the. Oh, I'm doing the. I'll do the meeple and then finish that one. Okay. And now when you do that, though, you, that locks that meeple there forever. Yeah. Okay? All right, so this is going to score now. You're going to get your meeple this here, and uh, Blue's going to get this one back. So you get first place and second. That's six points for Callie. So good. And that is three points, or four points for Kim. Mm -hmm. Okay. And yeah. then it's my, now it's my turn. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. This was a six, right? Okay. Yeah. Both six. Um... Mm -hmm. You can flip it though. I can. Yeah, so I'm gonna do this, I think. And then I'm gonna place this here, I you think. Get a, you get a an evil. Uh, do I want to no, I don't. One is nice because it's a wild ability. Can yeah. you use any other one? Alright, and I'm yeah, mm -hmm. so I'm gonna put that there. Okay, so this one goes here, and it's now the next person with the bag. Neat. I could have filled this up if I wanted to, but I don't want to spend all my meeples just yet. I haven't played oh, this nice. with okay. four Jeez. players. So. Look at all the ones. All right, Caitlin, good choice. Then good choice, can, you guys. I can do this here, right? Well, I'm not going to get anything good. So you can do, yeah, you can pretty much do anything. You can put this one this, here. This red one can go over here because it's not, It's this is a three, right? So as long as it's yeah. not a three, you can put it here. This one can go here and fill this. And you can actually take this if you have the. Um, she has if a you, wizard. If, right you have, if you have the cultus, you can yeah. take that, and I'll score you first place and mess and screw us over. That's what I want to do. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you could also take the ones no here and place them over here, <laughs> and and you also place take the one here and go put it over there. I'll do that. Let's go there. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then. And so you're gonna score one point because it's on the first level. Okay. And then you're also going to score six points because you got. Two. Oh, you got two, and I only have one, and Ferdinand only has one. So we're actually going to tie and get three points apiece. Me and Ferdinand here. Voila. That was my first point ever. And, and then we return the all the meeples. There you, you go. Do you, want, do you want to hide points? Do we hide points? Yeah, I'm, I'm hiding mine. It doesn't yeah. matter, but oh, you can. Uh, um, Sandbox Gaming says we finished your giveaway box, by the way. Ooh, Yay! I like giveaway box. Right now, we're still using my beautiful pick a nick basket, but we look forward to a giveaway box. <laughs> Or, or the Dante, <laughs> or the Dante box. Okay, okay. Okay, All uh, right. continue so turn. I will take, hmm, there's a lot of yellow. Maybe take the red one and get two points. Okay, two points for you. Thank you. And then it's me now. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to go, hey, what are you doing? It's just a regular guy. Uh-huh. I'm watching you. No wizard, no wizard. <laughs> yeah, but he also has that wild. All right, I'm gonna, it. I'm gonna go. And that'll net me. Well, let's go with my super wizard. That'll net me uh, two points. All right, Ferdinand, you're up. One or four. Oh, yeah, I guess I might as well just take the. <laughs> Actually, I can. I can use this meeple. Because I can do this. Change it to any color I want. Yep. Mm -hmm. oh. Okay. I get a point for that immediately. Yep. And then we all tie. So we all get. You can use your cultist, you know. Oh, that's, that's, what that's what I meant. That's what I meant. Okay. That's what I meant. Okay. So that will score you six points. <laughs> And that will score Callie and I uh, the, tie the tie, which is three. <sighs> Gary Dworski doesn't want you to upgrade your pick basket. He loves your pick My <laughs> poor pick basket, That is yes. Dante's toy basket. <laughs> that is my dog's toy basket. Okay, all right. I, I, so here I we go. Here we go. It every week. All right. Okay, next. 
Me. And this goes over here. Yeah. I love how, the, how fast this game goes. Yeah, it's quick, it right? Yeah. Really it's real quick. It's real fast. fast. Gets to the point. Right. These are and, not and the, the colors. Really. I, like the <laughs> I like how fast the progression in the game as well. So. It's gonna be tough. Bridgie, you have my aunt to the. I don't see All my right. aunt going in. She she messaged. Gary, how you doing, Gary? Nice to see you as well. He actually, you remember Gary? He actually had um, Imperium, the contention, right? Be. Right, right by Fickle and the Escape from Dulce yeah, was, okay. was Gary in his game. Yes. I'm just going to go straight Brilliant up. Two game. points, please. Two points for you. you. Okay. Thank you. All right. My turn? Yep. Oh, you guys are trying to mess with me, aren't you? No one wants to be nice. All I want is points. That's all I want. Um. Oh, heck. What do I want to do? Okay, let's pull this off. I'm going to turn this into any color I want. I'm going to put this guy here, and then I'm going to stack this guy here. That's going to score me six. And nobody else gets anything. Anything, and you lose mm. one meeple. Yep. Which is worth it. Oh, no! Oh. Well, the tower well, is... Wait a, a second, because he's going to flip the next one. Oh, I know what I'm it doing, might, though. Well, it might change. Uh -huh. Wait. <laughs> oh, <laughs> did it change after all, huh? That's three points right there you can get. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm going to do. All right, three points for thee. Mm. All right. Okay. Can I use this? I can change this die. Yep. Now what does it let you do? Can I make it purple? Oh, it changes purple to the color. Yeah, yeah. Yes, you can. Yeah, yeah. And if I put it here, do I get? I get one, right? You get to put well, another meeple. You can put another meeple on one, or you can put another meeple on any of the spaces on the board. I would, I would put a meeple down. You have, you and have you, a lot then of meeples. Yeah. For it. yeah. If I put well, my wizard down, you don't I need know, to. My wizard, I don't need no. to. All right. Because you're going to lose this meeple. Yeah, you don't want to lose your wizard. Yeah, all right. Yeah. Okay, so that's going to score you six, and Callie is going to score her four. Helping each other out. Yes. <laughs> do we get, less, power? Uh, do we get a, like, one less meeple or something for this type of game? Or? <laughs> no? no? Okay. All right, and then Thank Green you. gets hers just back. Just like we have a lot of meeples. Mm -hmm. Blue gets over. hers. Not the same. Okay. This goes up. And there's one left. Yep. It goes here. Okay, I'm up. I like the bag. Look at it. Fancy. <laughs> All right. All right. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Come on, baby. Daddy needs a new. Oof. Ooh, that was that was rough. Oof. Oof. The blue. It's a six. Oof. Is that a six? Yes. Yeah. I think he was reaching for it anyway. That's a good roll for Arkham Horror. Right. <laughs> <laughs> That's going to score me six. <laughs> and yellow, four. Where's my, is that, is that my wizard? Right there. Oh, you, oh, you wizard, I have two, two and three. Yeah, and yes, two. I understand now. And we score. Well done, Ferdinand. You're so welcome. <laughs> Lucky. Okay. Humbug. You're being cheered. Oh, him. blue. <laughs> Blue's yeah. not for you. Get the points. Yeah, my fans. Okay. All right, I'll get two points from that. For what? Oh, from here? Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm going to do some exchangings. All right, let me know what you need. Five, please. Yes, sir. Give me another five, please. Yes, sir. Happy to exchange. And the market is willing. Give me another ooh, five. Give me another five? Yeah. Dang, son, <laughs> you're rich. Okay, I'm done. All right. You sure? How you guys liking this game? Looking good? Hey, Matt, how you doing, man? We're not doing so great. Yeah. <laughs> well, if I take this guy, I this just is the only place I can show, right? You can't go there because it might says go to oh. six there. Uh, okay, I don't think there's any. Uh, it can't be equal. Yeah, you there's cannot put either. anything. You have to go in the middle. You have to go in the middle, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. So, and collect Good. a spell. Yeah, it doesn't matter oh, where it goes. Yeah. There? Yeah. Okay. And so yeah. you get one of your people's, and now you can you can charge that. Now she can also put one of her dudes. She can also put one of her dudes on the board here, right? Or you can do the three. She could also put one of her meeples on any of the spaces as well, yeah, right? If you want. Yeah. I'll I'll do this one. Okay. I'll do the, right. swap. I'll do the three. Okay. And put a meeple on the three. I'll flip a roo. Boop. Over halfway done. It might be even sooner. No, no, three more rounds. How many how many rounds is it? Eight rounds. Each, each. Is there even enough in there for? Sure. Eight rounds? I guess there must be. <laughs> yeah, there is. Okay. Enough. There's like yeah. I, still, exactly I feel fifteen. Yeah. Exactly enough. Okay. okay. I feel fifteen, or this is like a misprint. 
<laughs> or some misprint. <laughs> oh, look at all those purples. Woo! Look at all them purples. But not the right number, purple. Okay, there's exactly enough. Yep, that one. Three. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. Is there six in there? There's no six, huh? Yep. You can... None of those are good. Yeah. Uh oh. <laughs> None of those Might are good. Might as nice. well collect them at the middle. I mean, I mean you, you collect the points for the middle, so. Yeah. Okay. There you go. I'll do that. Okay, uh, so first place for the oh, middle is going to score two. three points, okay. and which is blue, and then green's going to get. One. Uh, no, you get two points. Oh, okay. Do you have a three for me? Uh, yeah, oh, for one. a one? Yep. And then blue gets theirs back. Mm -hmm. Thank you. All right. And All right. Callie, you're up. I'll use my ability to. Oh, no, no, it goes like this. That one, yeah. yeah. Flip this one and to a six to play. Um, yeah, I'll play here. Uh, and with your and your main one, huh? Yeah. Well, this it doesn't matter, I guess. <laughs> if I yeah. put it here. Okay, so that's going to score Callie six points. Yeah. And that will score Ferdinand four, right? Mm -hmm. All right, there you go. And then you get yours back, you get yours back. And that guy stays there. Come on! <laughs> no, not what you Just collect a spell. It's Mm. What do I want to do? Ooh, blocking yeah. that one so that no one can get four points there. All right, who's up next? It's yours, right? Is it me? Yeah. Yeah, so I went first. Okay. One more? One more. Okay. Oof. Hmm. Okay, I can do this. Right. What is, what is, oh, not equal to six. Mm -hmm. But if I do this, can I, um, do I automatically get two points? You get two points? points? Yeah. But I don't get, in the, put, put, I, I don't get fact, all of you the, trade me a three, don't get scored at the end. I'll give you a okay. five. Yeah. <sighs> all right. Callie? So. Yeah, at the end of the game, it would be based, it'll, these will all score as well. Who you guys think is gonna win this one? I, I'm I'm not too sure right now. I'm not I'm not looking so hot. I don't think. I'm sorry, Ferdinand. Oh yes, you are. <laughs> yes, you are. Okay. Stealing everyone's oh, work. <laughs> that is what you do. Six points, and Ferdinand gets four. Mm. You, you still get points. Thank God. <laughs> there you go. And new one flips over, please. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's yeah, so yeah. good. Got lucky there. Um. Two options. Bye, Mikey. Bye. This is gonna go here, and that's gonna score me four points. I'm surprised no one else saw that. Yeah, but six points is more than four. <laughs> yeah, but it's more than two. Your answer's yeah, that's what after I was like, uh, I should have done that. I was like, damn it. Yeah. Bridget says, go, Michael, go, go, go. <laughs> that's right. That's right. And Mikey says, go, Kim, go, 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 go. <laughs> Earlier. Don't worry, Caitlin. I, 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 it's, it's not over yet for you. Is that you? I still might there? be okay. Yeah. Three, three, I got three, three points. points. For me. All right. Okay. Callie, you're up last. This is it. One last round. All right. Am I, I don't know if I'm feeling it. We'll see. Oh, there's I don't know. Okay. I don't know. Dear, dear. Ooh, yellow. Uh oh, red. Okay. And then purple. There's no tower thing. Hmm. I guess the best. That's one and two for purple. Yep. Okay, this one. Not this again. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for oh, wow. <laughs> All right, so six points for Callie. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. 
and four for Ferdinand. And that's my turn, right? Yeah. Well, we'll get another. Uh, and we love you. <laughs> Hi, John. Oh, that's better. Hi, John. Not really. Well, yeah, maybe. I can play this This is... Now. Oh, it's so useful. Do I... What do I want to do now? I have a, I have a very... I have a very good power this play This is the right end of the game already. This is the last round. Yeah. So. That's we did a lot of <laughs> Basically, until you run out of die, pretty much. That's what it seems like. Six. Whatever you left on the board will score as well, so... That can go any of those spaces. Ah, yeah. <laughs> and then we're going to score here. Six points for me. Of course. <laughs> and four for you. Thank you. And I get my little dude back. You get your little dude back. A flippy, flippy, floppy. All right. That was the last Ooh. round for me. Now I will win this one now. <laughs> it is mine. <laughs> That's just fine with me. <laughs> six points for me, or six points for you? Sorry, and four for me. I had a meeple. I put a meeple in there to add a meeple. All right, and then you get your little dude back. Our dudes are chilling. <laughs> oh, oh, the tower is getting real. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the towers are stacking up now. Okay. <laughs> Oh, there's only one little, one little. One, there's only one left. That's the best one right now, I think, right there. Right? Yeah. Yeah. I have this. Can I play my wizard? Five points. Yeah. You're the last person. Yeah. Well, yeah. Last person, so doesn't matter. Go for it. That's well, a, and I don't that know such what a good one. Yeah, yeah, that's a, yeah, that's so nice. Yeah. I mean, I do also have a. Like, you you want to place I, there? Yeah. No. That's gonna give you five points. No I need uh, a. five. Oh. I've got four ones left. So oh. give me some of your. Uh, I got four. I got four here. Five points. It doesn't matter how you exchange it. So she gets a plus one. Give her the four, and I'll just write a one next okay. to hers, so we know. Okay, and there's All still right. more points to go. Yeah. yeah. Okay. There's so. Right here. So we're gonna okay. score. It's gonna score. You. Okay. Okay. All right. So we're gonna score bonus. First place in an area is gonna score you three points. So I'm gonna get six points here. So plus six for me, and then plus three for Kim over here. And then there's nothing else. No one else has anything. You can use the die to add yeah. extra points. You can, ask, you can use it to remind yourself. So plus six for me. Um, okay, let's come up. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hers is plus four. I'm just plus four, yeah. Okay. All right, so then we're going to count our score up and see who has the most. All right, I'm going to hide Mine it. is 45. 45. Okay. Mine is 45. Thirty-eight. Thirty-three. Plus your four? Plus, plus four. Yep. So 45. thirty. What? <sighs> so how, wait. I had thirty-three. Feels good. Okay. But not super good because I got selected. I got forty. So Ferdinand, you oh, got it. Oh, well I done, Ferdinand. I finally good won job. something here. Good Thank you. This is your golf clap. That's all you get. <laughs> well done. Yeah, right. <laughs> this is my first time winning. It's okay. Yeah. I got the uh, Rob, Van, and Drew. I, I came close, but I was not close yeah. enough. He he kept getting the drop on for he kept getting the drop on for yeah. those that second place over and over again. Yeah. Beautiful little tower game gave though. Too many points. Uh, yeah. Okay. 10, 20, 30, 34 plus 6, 40. I tried my best. And this little guy would go here. I would end it. So, how'd you like it? Fun? Very fun. That was like, like an easy one to pick up too, as you're like first, yeah. first time. Mm -hmm. So that is the Towers of Arcanos. Yeah, oh, coming soon from IDW. They had they did a Kickstarter a year or two ago, and then IDW picked it up, and they're gonna be um, publishing it here. Yeah, publishing it and getting more more produced for everyone. Yeah. Yeah, totally fun. I like this game a lot. If you like stuff like Sagrada and whatnot. Is it giveaway time? Yeah. Oh. Yay, giveaway time. Yeah, I'm getting it. Give away any games. Yet. Give me some smoke. Uh, over there. Oh, that's, <laughs> that's called poor planning. There you go. Let's get the smoke. Woo. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah. <laughs> and then we need some lights too. Some light action. You gotta turn off the big main lights too, right? Yeah. yeah. Let's see if that works. <laughs> Oh, Baggy? Is it too dark? Baggy? 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 I can see it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Go win some games! I need a baggy. There you go. You got a baggy for it. What is this? I don't even know. <laughs> nice they want bubbles. Meh. How about this? People are demanding bubbles. There we go. Not get bubbles. No bubbles. We're, we're bubbleless right now. Yeah, they didn't learn that magic yet. So. All know. right. They didn't have any bubbles at Target. Last yeah. chance, you guys. Last chance. You guys haven't yet. Go ahead and uh, subscribe to the Cardboard Stacker. And they'll get you in here really quick. If you haven't uh, put your name in for the subscribe, let us know before we start pulling. Um, as well as taking a look at Brilliant or BS, which is going to be currently Ooh. on. Yes. BrilliantRBS.com. BrilliantRBS.com. We got, it got funded, and now you guys are going to have copies in pretty pretty soon here, right? Yeah, within the next couple of weeks. Awesome. Oh, yes. yeah. So I hope you guys Exciting. have some fun with that, as well as the Towers of Arcanos. Next week, we're going to do Fickle uh, Tuesday. So if you're interested in checking that out, you can go ahead and do so. Uh, hope you had a little bit of fun tonight. Yes. A little bit, little bit, little fun. bit of fun. You, you guys have some fun, too? Yeah, it was very nice. If you're going to Origins, please let me know, and we'll, we'll meet up. I'll say hello. I'll let you buy me a beer. Or we'll have beers together. Whatever, whatever you want. I mean, if you want to. I, I even drink beer, actually. Yeah. <laughs> All right, last chance, guys. Go ahead and let me know. If you haven't, uh, you can go ahead and uh, support us on Patreon. Please. I want that dollar. One dollar. One dollar. Fund my doctor's visit for the carpal tunnel. <laughs> One more. All right. All right, let's go ahead and give away Ice cool, but not this one. This is mine. I'm gonna give away ice cool number one. You ready? Ice cool dance. Pulling out Ferdinand. This is for you. <laughs> From Ferdinand. Yeah. Yeah. Congratulations to the people. What do you Broadway. got? Jeremy. Jeremy, this person. Jeremy Shida. Shida. All right. Well Yay. done, Jeremy. Yay. But not this one, this one's mine! <laughs> hey, here you go. I, I just messaged him to get the address. Right. So I will, I'll, I'll do And you can do yeah, one just yeah. for the game. Yes. Yes. Right. Brilliant or, or BS! Bullshizzle! <laughs> Hashtag family friendly. Right. That'd be family. Right. Family friendly. Um, Alright. Here we go. Alright. The lucky winner is. Mikey! All right, well done, good <laughs> sir. You scored it. Thank you for supporting me, Mikey. What a, what a culture, wonderful, culture wonderful human being. <laughs> you guys want some more? Let me see what I got in the back room. I suppose we can do that. I'm going to go ahead and pull some more. I got to do two more random games. Rando games for you guys supporting us. Mystery giveaways. Mystery giveaway. Basically, I'll just pull something out of the back area. Maybe you'll like it, maybe you won't. I don't really care. You get a free game. What do you want? What do you care, huh? It's costing me shipping. You better enjoy it. All right. There you go. Um, so I always try and give away at least a couple things. That way it clears some space from the area. <laughs> more fog! Yep, you want more fog? <laughs> yep, more here fog. we go. Oh, I'm compared to the fog. Right. Fog is Woo! good. <laughs> All right, bonus giveaway. Ambiance. Bonus mystery giveaway. Maybe too much fog. All right, Walters! You scored another bonus giveaway, good sir. Woo! One more. Yay. One more. Yay. One more. Another. Bonus. Right. Look, right. makes it make nice and squishy um, in here. If you're local, we can always pick up. Okay. 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 Thank you guys for watching. You know, it's a pleasure. We have a bunch of people coming on throughout the next two months. Yes. So we'll have Brother Wise Games coming on from Boss Monster. And we're going to be having uh, Ross Thompson with IDW. Uh, they're going to be showing us the game, um, I don't know, some miniature game. It's cool. Yeah, he's coming. He is finally coming after Origins from IDW. And then we are very likely to have AEG as well. And we're going to be showing off Tiny Towns and uh, some other cool games. So. 
yeah, hope you guys have some fun with that. Um, we'll have it out posted up on the Facebook page and whatnot. There's a bunch of fa uh, reviews right now going on for all the games. If you want to check them out, you can go ahead and so do so on our YouTube channel. We have. It is a season because. Yeah, it's, Oregon, it is Gen crazy Gen right now for us. I am so burnt yeah. out, guys. I mean, I'm <laughs> having the time of my life uh, doing this. It doesn't kill my voice, and I'm definitely not staying up till 4 a.m. editing videos. All right, well. I think we're good. Anything else you want to say, Ferdinand? I'm good. If you, if you guys don't know me, I'm the Carbridge Stacker. You can find me on YouTube, the Carbridge Stacker, and you can find all sorts of videos and reviews and tutorials and all that great stuff. Screaming infidelities! <laughs> <laughs> no. Last chance to yes, push it out there. Say, thank you guys for having me. I hope you guys have fun playing and have fun watching at home. BrilliantRBS.com. We're live. <laughs> it's a good game. I really enjoyed yeah, that. That was, that was a lot of fun. fun. It's Thanks great because I didn't have to know the answers. Right. <laughs> Kelly! Uh, bye. <laughs> All right. I like that. Okay. All right. Grant, you know the drill, right? When we end it, we're actually not going to end it, and we're just going to let... Okay. All right, guys. Are you ready? No, how about this way? Have you seen right. our stream before? Yes, I have, but I don't know sure what's happening. The end of, the okay, here we go. <laughs> they don't know. You don't know. It's going to work out perfectly. So I'm going to cover the mic here. All right. What's going to happen is at the end of the stream here, we're all going to do this. All right, thank you guys for watching, and as always, I appreciate it. Looking forward to seeing you guys next time. We're doing it all at once. It's going to look great. It's going to be so, okay. looks very, very choreography, you know, perfect. Grant's going to then cut guys. to the end. We're, I'm going to go ahead and clean up and let you. you, point you. Yes. We'll, do, we'll do some bantering, and uh, then that'll be the end of the stream. Right. Okay? You guys ready for this? All right. Thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, I look forward to seeing you guys yes. next time. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. I said it's yeah, over. Right. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I have to say, that's probably one of the most. This is probably one of the best times I've had here. Yeah? Yeah. Well, thanks a lot, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I love that. Every yeah. night is fun night at my house. Yeah, well, it number. keeps getting better. That's, that's right. right. Okay, you're right. cool. That's what he wrote to your hours. Like, he's at work now. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, this is the first time I get to see the yeah. lights and the fog machine. Yeah. Okay. I'm more likely to And I heard there's a bubble machine. machine. There is a bubble okay. machine, but we had no not even bubbles right now. Oh, uh, okay. What games you guys want to see me play next week? We're going to bring we'll have Fickle, but I'm going to play another one. So let me know what you want to see played. Leave in the comments. You still got another couple minutes here while I banter and whatnot. So this is your first game ever made? Yes, it is. Uh, first card game, but I do. I'm a talent producer by nature, so I do TV game shows and competition shows. Nice. So this is the first oh, time really? Done, like, so party you, party you live game. in LA, then? I do. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, so so what? What? Um, what TV shows have you done? I've done Hell's Kitchen, mm -hmm. uh, Project Runway. Oh, a new game show that's going to be uh, airing on ABC this month called Holy Moly, which is extreme oh. miniature golf. I don't know if you've seen any commercials <laughs> okay. for it. It's, extreme yeah, mini it's golf. Ex yeah, ABC's golf. been getting back on the game show. Yes, yeah, so there's some more fun in games. So it's I, like I games actually games. Uh, worked in LA as well. Oh yeah. I did stuff for um, the Asylum, a very prominent yes. and um, important <laughs> studio. Yeah. I did. Uh, I worked with Sharknado. I did the Little Dead Rotting oh. Hood. I did. Oh, what was the other one? I don't remember the other one from them. They had a bunch of garbage horror movies. <laughs> and then I also did. Cherry Pop. Cherry Pop, which is on Netflix right now. And I'm okay. I'm in it as an actor, as I'm well as I did The Grip and Electric, which was fun. I do Genie. I, I, I do Genie. Like, really okay, you guys see all cool stuff. And yeah. then he talks himself into being on the okay, camera. Yeah, yeah. 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 see, so, like, we gotta get this guy on camera. We gotta get in front of the camera. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's great. Yeah, so it's a, you know, that kind of stuff. But yeah, I, I, did, I also did some reality TV show. Um, okay. Hmm. But What's it called? On the crew or like on Heavenly, I'm, like a cast member? Okay, it is it is a it is an all black version of The Bachelor, and it has a oh. pastor that is the I, is for it the love of money it, or it wasn't the love it was something that's like that, um, but it was like but recent right or no? Yeah, yeah, not not too long ago. It, well, it aired recently. Yeah, it aired I recently. It yeah, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Oh, so was I, it for BET? Yes. Yes, yes. I didn't see it, but I yes, I know of it. What did you do on it? I worked as I worked as Gripper. Oh, okay. So cool. I did all the lighting. Lighting, and yeah, yeah, yeah. Watched him. I mean, it's just funny. It's just a yeah. huge like. It was just it was interesting too because my buddy was just like, "All right, we're gonna do a reality TV show." I'm like, "I've never done that. I've done commercials, <laughs> I've done movies, but I've never reality TV." And all these gals just crazy. 
insane oh, yeah, people. Yeah, like what, what goes like like any kind of dating and like romantic shows like that. That's why I stick with just like game shows because then you just have to it's just people compete. It's all about your skill or talent, you know. Yeah. So like this mini golf one is really funny. Like we put them through some crazy stuff. Like you're trying to like putt and like craziness. Is going on. <laughs> it's like a good family show. So if they're, yeah, I think it's gonna uh, do well. Pretty, it's Grant's yeah, trying to pull likes pretty, so that she can yeah, so he can get people to to see what's going on. Awesome. Yeah, game. I mean, I, I didn't tell my back gave out, but it was yeah, it's fun. Yeah, on your feet yeah. all day. 12, you know, 12 on, 12 off, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. With, your, well, with crew, yes. The producers, it's, they, we have no, it doesn't matter. It's like, we don't get overtime. We don't get, you know, there's no real union for us. So we're, mm -hmm. I'm working 14 to 16. <laughs> so. Yeah, so, well, thank you for coming. I appreciate yeah, it. I hope you had some fun. Yeah, I had of fun. Course. It was great hanging out with you guys, too. Yeah, that was right. a fun, that was a good round. Like, you've got the BS down. <laughs> like, that is, like, the brilliance of, br I, of BS. I you told you, know what I mean? you BSing. Yes, yeah. he did, absolutely. They were like, I don't know. I think she's, like, because yeah. Hell. Hell. so nice. You don't expect yeah. to lie. Michael. <laughs> That's what it is. Michael is nice, but when it comes to the games, you, you kind of expect it. him. Yeah. You expect him to try to win. <laughs> Ooh, more fun. That's right. <laughs> yeah! We're gonna come, we'll come back! You ready? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Go home! Go to bed! Go Why are you still up? <laughs> like Ferris Bueller. Get out of here! It's, the show's over! Nope, that's it. What do you want? What do you want? What else do you want? <laughs>